at studying the Vilar King for our own power and wealth. And the monsters at our door. I laughed so hard when it happened. You jumped literally at the face. Yeah. Yeah. Um, it was not my best moment, not gonna lie. In that game, it was not my best moment. Nice. Oh, I appreciate the recommendations, and I'd love to have more time to read, but unfortunately, my time is my time is of the essence, as they say. But uh, in my case, uh, yeah, time is slipping away from me. Still I need waiting. to get a better structure you, in my life. We cannot return empty-handed. It is simply out of the question. Have you reconsidered? Will you take the offer? Let's go to Tucson, lads. Ready it's to time go. to pack Seems up. You're packed. Ah, then post haste to Tucson. To Tucson. To Tucson. We're going to Tucson. Ooh, the horsey has golden armor. It's kind of pretty. I think if anyone likes pretty games, be be. I think Jay, especially as an artist, you're gonna appreciate the the pretty pictures, the pretty background, and the pretty setting of this DLC. Mord, I, I typed it out, but I hope I said it earlier. Thank you so much for the resub, by the way. I really appreciate it. Look at the diamond tofu emote beside you. You a diamond. You a diamond supporter. Toussaint, the land of love and wine. The land of Is love and wine. You will find Beauclair has changed some these past years. Damn. Walk about when you have the chance. You will see for yourself. To me, place always seemed straight out of a fairy tale. Knights errant, elven palaces. You insinuate that we are somehow odd? <laughs> I shall prove you wrong. This I pledge on the heron. Oh? What's that? What the hell? <gasps> oh my god Hi Nas Oh Jesus Christ Why does that guy have chains and he has a barrel on his head? Honestly, like, no jokes as jokes aside, like, he looks like he does need a hug. Elias. Oh. That's not what I pressed. Bonk. Now that is a bonk hammer. Alright, that wasn't too difficult. Oh, Jesus, I got shoved away. The sheep! The sheep! Big beast. Tackling it single handed. None too wise. Neither is love born of wisdom, Witcher. So, Guillaume, outfit it. Which fair damsel inspired you to vow to kill that filth? The most beautiful among them. If he wishes to guard her name a secret, he need not reveal it. Wait. You I do not know, sir, nor seem you a knight, yet still I am profoundly grateful, nay, indebted to you for your succor. This trophy, sir, is yours. 
Wait, that accent, that voice. Why do I know that voice? A giant this close to human settlements? Strange. Well, that was no ordinary giant. His name was Goliath. Sounds Dutch Rumor to me. Dutch, voice, Swedish, something. For this, the Lady of the Lake transformed him into a wild giant and banished him into the Gorgon Hills. So he came back down? Why? Several times each year, hunger chased him into the lowlands. Maybe we're just confusing with Goliath some streamer. <laughs> many shepherds. Guillaume's hunt served a noble cause. At any rate, it's a tale for more agreeable environs. I'll take the trophy. Why not? Could find someone who'll pay to buy it. Put up a good fight against the giant. Got experience battling monsters? He got bunked. What no. do you mean? In Tucson, we mostly chase bandits. But I vowed I'd bring my heart's champion the head of a monstrosity, as the famed Gottfried, known as the Giant Killer, did. You don't mean to this is the We just started Blood and Wine, yeah? That is best left to Geralt. Another challenge awaits me. Yet if Geralt is to hunt the beast, he ought to know. It struck again. Uh oh. The river surrendered a corpse. It washed up in the meander by the cockatrice. Damien Delatour's guardsmen are there already, securing the area. Securing the area? Better go there now before they trample any tracks, manhandle any evidence. Set forth then. I shall ride for the city to Can any of you guys take Geralt seriously in his outfit and clothes? We'll meet later. Near Guillaume's tent of the Tourney grounds. Sounds more Swedish. I, I would say. See her grace. I don't know for sure though. We'll see. The glasses add to the seriousness. <laughs> Oh my goodness. Max Santos, thanks a million for the raid. Welcome, welcome in, raiders. Right now. Welcome in. But protect the stream, right chat home. Hello, a clowno. A lot of familiar names. A lot of familiar names. Welcome in. Welcome in. Oh, damn it. I wanted to click on the follow thing, but then it disappeared. I'll have to manually do it. Ugh. Ugh. You're for Maximus. Thanks so for the follow. Hello, hello, everyone. Welcome in. Hi, my name is Tiny Toxic Tofu. I'm... Supposedly tiny, supposedly toxic, and a tofu. We're just playing Witcher 3 at the moment. Um, we are a streamer from Ireland, and we just are starting the DLC Blood and Wine. So if you haven't played it, I absolutely understand if you need to hop out so that there's no spoilers for you. But if you're sticking around, welcome. Enjoy the adventure as we travel through Toussaint, as they call it here. We just slayed Goliath the Giant. Ooh, and it had new And it has a new sword. Is this sword good? Oh. It's a good sword. Not a bad sword at all. Blood and wine is fantastic. I hope so. I'm gonna I'm gonna play through it and see how I get on with it. Hopefully it's good. That still only counts as one. one. Thanks for the follow, Max Santos. Appreciate it. Brave kid, Guillaume. But I'm not scared of spoilers. Oh! What's this? In Blood and Wine, you can undergo additional Witcher mutations to unlock new capabilities. Soon, you will run into a messenger who will deliver you a very interesting letter. Read it and investigate the story of Professor Moro to learn more about these mutations. They say a master craftsman lives in Toussaint who can craft Witcher gear of unequaled quality. What's more, you receive special bonuses for wearing all or part of a set of this extraordinary equipment. You will not regret investigating these new options. Interesting. Interesting. Oh, I love the sound of grasshoppers and the long grass. It just reminds me of Russia so much, you know, Russia in the summer. Or I guess any heated place. Can't get used to the way you knights talk, especially how you switch back and forth between flowery and, well, <laughs> near normal. 
in the service of her gracious magnificence when we appear in her name where the deers at no jay we're not going to run over the deers no i saw sheep so far this place this place might be full of sheep wow look at this scenery look at this scenery guys must have removed the body already Let's look around. Make sure we didn't miss anything. Do you know what this kind of reminds me? It's too grassy, but it's like Tuscany or something like that. It gives very Italian vibes. Even though I would have thought it would be more like French vibes. Um, just the kind of... I guess the bright colors, maybe. Hub makes me think boots, of Tuscany. You can run over peacock, peacocks here. Guard, clearly. Let's see where they went. <laughs> I like how he come Milton along the shoreline. Perhaps the body lay on the bank. Starts looking as if he knows what he's doing. Tuscany for sure. Got guests. Careful. Oh! Wait. Scurver. Is, is that a new monster? <laughs> the music. Oh my god! Oh, they explode like the barrels. I have to be careful of that. Show me what you got. <gasps> and they launch spikes. Oh wow! Blast. Oh, hit the basket. Oh. Nice. Drawn here by the smell. The music is great. Go Higny, everything melts under the sun. <laughs> Let me just repair my armor. It seems to be on a little bit of the damaged side. The colors are so saturated. It's all ex see. You sound like a person who knows art, because I wouldn't have Let's used those looking. words. But that's a correct terminology. <laughs> this makes me want to play. Have you played it before? I thought, am I mistaken it? Because I know you were playing Cyberpunk, but I wonder, did you finish this game? Did you say, were you going to play it this? I wasn't sure. I might be getting confuzzled here. Only blood-soaked scraps left of the victim's clothing. Good quality cloth. A wealthy victim, correct? Looks it. Although all of you dress so colorfully, how could you tell if the victim blood. was wealthy or not? Guardsmen pulled these nets out of the I water. I have played it, but I need to play it again. Yeah. Body free. So I was in the same boat. I played this before, and I decided to play it again, Good and I have then. no regrets. Sure didn't miss anything. It's so nice and cozy. Now, my house is very small in it, and I have the window permanently closed, pretty much. But I need to, like, do something to my house to make it more cozy. My bedroom and my living room. I'm gonna put up the Christmas tree this weekend. That'll definitely make it cozier. Anything taken by the current ends up in these shallows. Yes, the stench is fierce. <laughs> Look at the rut. Guardsmen left this site by boat recently. Probably so to cozy. transport the body somewhere. Tiny toe cozy. The weather's just... Fantastic for it. Oh, there's something on the water. Loot? Oh. <laughs> oh, it's just loot? Quest updated Beast of Toussaint. Said kerchief. Monogrammed DLC. DLC? Accessory, clearly. DLC? His initials are DLC in a DLC. Poggers. What now? This isn't the site of the murder. We know that. Current brought the body here. Corpse got caught in the nets. Guardsmen pulled it out, put it in a boat, and took it somewhere. Need Damn. to find out where. I'd like to look at the corpse before it starts to decompose. The inn. 
Its patrons must have seen the guardsmen, which direction they took. We should ask there. Are they looking at something? Why are they just kind of standing there like that Seems creepily? We've got ourselves an audience. You think this surprising? Should have a German accent, the really? Will tell the children of children they do not have yet of the day a quartered corpse was pulled from the river. One thing. Now nah, he's giving he's giving me Morpheus vibes. Monogrammed DLC. Mean anything to you? Delacroix. Delacroix. It cannot be. Was it he the beast slew? Seems so. Knew him well? Long past. We were close friends once, but our paths diverged. We were a man of extremes. Standing by his companions, no matter the odds. Fighting his foes to the bitter end. Foes? You have a lot of them? He did. But I do not see what that has to do with the beast. Ah, Geralt. You've struck a raw nerve. No, it's not. I gave up. I was going to start this stream with no coffee, but this is how badly my no coffee day started today. I slept in, first of all. I'm going to yawn now. I'm holding in the yawn. Because if I start yawning, oh no. <laughs> I promise I'm not actually that tired. I just gave up on my no coffee attempt this week. I started my stream, I got my pot of tea here, I was ready to go start to stream at 12 o'clock and then I was like, no, I can't do this, I need coffee. And I didn't, I just did not have the energy um, to continue, um, so I had to go downstairs and make coffee, which is why I was late. And I was so tired, I didn't do a science and technology segment today because I'm just so exhausted. I'm hoping the coffee will kick in soon. Memories of a time long past to which I'd rather not return I suck, now. I know, I suck. I understand. We can talk later. Let's go to the tavern. All right, let's I go to the tavern. To you soon. Return to court. Barely got back to Tucson. A knight in the service of her illustrious highness knows no rest. In fact, I'd feared I would return too late to fulfill my duty. Yet it seems I've arrived in the nick of time. <laughs> There's something funny about the way he's jogging, honestly. Something cute about it. Welcome Hi, Tarek. Mr. Anderson. Coffee is life. Espresso is greatness. I forget myself at times. We address each other by our first names in private. Never in Pomrin's presence, however. He finds such familiarity offensive. The guard brings peace to our domains. Flouted the watering hole for traders, smugglers, boatmen. But you will find no better crayfish chowder Crayfish in all chowder? <gasps> Let me Google what a crayfish looks like. I think I have something in mind. Crayfish. Yes. It's like a lobster, basically. A smaller lobster. Crayfish chowder sounds delicious. No oh, we have Cyprus. Announcement of the Office of Eternal Revenue of Duchy of Toussaint. Now I want charter, yeah. The Office of Internal Revenue hereby announces a limited live auction to be held regarding the sale of a piece of developed real estate and accompanying agricultural land located in Caraberta Woods region, having been left to the ducal treasury by the late Count Crespi, who departed this world without any heirs. Due to the unique nature of the Belgard estate and its important role in the production of wine, bringing great fame to the duchy in all corners of the world, only subjects of the Duchy of Toussaint shall be allowed to participate in the auction. To all knights errant and other men of arms, it might be f known far and wide that the service of voluntary keepers of the peace shall be needed. Minor problems are expected to arise during the trans transfer of the above-mentioned real estate, and said problems for the dissolution could require the application of direct physical force. All volunteers are asked to report to the field office of the Procreator General of Toussaint near Plegman's Bridge. 
That is to say, to the place where the auction will be held. The Grey Buckler Gwent. Oh! There's a Gwent! There's a Gwent tournament! It is Count Monaire's supreme delight to announce a Gwent tournament of his organization. Those wishing to take part should register at the Pheasantry. Please note this tournament features a new faction developed by Count Monier himself. Let the games begin. Two poor clerks looking for help. It'd be good coin to be made. I love your new emote, Cora. Do you do your your own emotes, or do you, did you draw all of them yourself? By my troth, could that be the musty scent of fresh pate? Naught else, Sir de Peyrac Peyron. I see time has not dulled your senses. We would be honored if you would join us. Uh, your companion as well. But why do I not detect even a whiff of crayfish chowder? No soup today. On account of there being no crayfish. <gasps> I reckon you No crayfish? Heard, but all I caught was a corpse. I awoke at the crack of dawn, as I do each day. But when I looked up, I beheld a blood red sky. Can't this figure out this guy's ass. Precisely why we're here. So it's crayfish hat. Yeah, you can post a food link here if you wish. The table was summoned from a far off land by her gracious magnificence. He is tasked with Yeah, the sunglasses one is good. We invited two men to join us, yet since Sir de Peyrac Peyron in temperament is more akin to hare than hound, I surmise the other is the hunter. With whom do we have the pleasure? Name's Geralt. A humble introduction. You've clearly not tarried long with Sir de Peyron <laughs> Spare us the petty insults. Geralt Wait, that was an was insult? Master of the Witcher in trade. He has questions concerning the beast's last victim. I was the one to find the corpse. The sun had just risen when I awoke, sat straight up in my bed, looked out the window, and beheld a sky red Doctor as Toxic. Blood. Ask Geralt, please, or we shall be here till winter. Must have been early in the morning. Went to check your nets and then... I stepped out of my hut and saw... By my troth, to the point, man. You found, found a body, body. <laughs> snared in your crayfish nets. We know this already. What happened then? Did you see anyone nearby? Did you spy anything noteworthy? Anything at all? Not a soul around, just me. What's this guy's so accent? Noteworthy. I can't really put my finger down on the way he's well, speaking. What did you see? But be warned, if I hear the sky was red again, <laughs> I saw a head. Popping, eyes, eyes bulging. bulging. The tongue blew and popped out. Next to it, a hand rocking upon the water. Get a good look at the body parts. They gave me such a fright. I bolted. I would say down Swedish or Norwegian. My legs would take me. Then I thought Swedish for a second too. Who told me to keep out of their way. They had a hard haul. The parts were so tangled up in it's my hard. head. It's hard. I think they're putting an accent on as well, you know, a little bit. So it's hard to say for sure what accent it is. to examine the body. Know where they took it? They ferried it across, then loaded it on a cart and hauled it to a cellar at Corfo Bianco. To keep Bianco. it cool, see? What? Why, Corfo Bianco is Baron Rassel's estate. When he learns they've turned his cellar into a morgue, he'll set his hounds on them. While you were gallivanting about the north, Ooh, his vineyard mysterious was figure. Off. Huh? Who was that woman who just left? Didn't see her before. Didn't notice her walk in either. Doubtless Linnis, the innkeeper's lord. But hold, Geralt, because this is an outrage. Rossell's vineyard was auctioned off. Inconceivable. It is no secret the Baron had. That word "inconceivable" is embedded in my mind as a line from Princess Bride. Anyone ever watched the movie Princess Bride? Inconceivable. That's that's all I have in my mind. But he's also a Ferengi in Deep Space Nine, and he shows up every like once a season or so, and just uh, that's all I know him for. After his it's years. a classic. <laughs> it finally came time to collect. His creditors auctioned off his property. The ducal chancellery bought it, in fact. 
Rassel now bunks with his brother in Vicofaro. The Grand Nagus, exactly, yes. Rassel, get his comeuppance. How long I watched the, the Princess Bride so many times. His creditors must finally Definitely have to find it. that his promises meant nothing. Such are the times. Today's knights are pale shadows of the heroes of yore. It's true what they say. God sent the beast to punish us for straying from the old paths. That guy's a big nose, I just realized. It's a very big so nose. folk think the beast's divine punishment is an eagle monster. You killed my father. Customs. Prepare. Where they were to defenders die. of the duchy, they're now defenders of their own tushes. Why, you insolent. Let him talk. The Duchess traits in titles, grants honors to Ildtuas. We've strayed from the path of virtue. She grants Lost titles to Ildurs? Why does he so say that, I wonder? Sent retribution. Don't listen to that nonsense, Geralt. It's rehashed street preacher Codswell. Yes, the rebel rousers have been sprouting up like weeds lately, each offering the same bill of goods. What else do they say about this beast? They say anything else about the beast? Besides Galaxy Qu No, I've never even heard of it. The two Saint Trois are no fools. They see clearly the beast kills on days honoring patron saints. Picky monster. <laughs> I like that quote as well. Uh, excessive. Oh yeah, Andre the Giant. That's true. That's true. Thanks for I the did hear a few years back. Time I examined the corpse. Covo Bianco lies a short way from here, near the tourney grounds. Just follow the road and you'll arrive. Not it was a book first, right? The Princess oh, yeah. Bride. Duty of some sort calls. Some sort? <laughs> Her grace bestowed a great honor on me, even before we departed for Velen. I'm to play the hare during this year's game in the Palace Gardens. When you see me in my costume, you will wet yourself laughing. He's so nice. I'm tempted to ask a few questions, but it sounds like a long, complicated story. One involving lengthy digressions into local history and tradition. So, see you later, Milton, and good luck. He seems very excited to be dressed as a bunny and running around the castle as a bunny. What's in the works today, Swilling? Uh, normally, I'd encourage you to try our famed fisherman's chowder, but alas, we are all out of crayfish. Could replace them with something else. Perch, for example. Ew, Replace not perch. Crayfish with fish, I beg you. What next? Vinegar for wine? Parsley for thyme? Huh? Your Nordlings are a pleasant lot, but about cuisine, you know nothing. <laughs> These are definitely Italian. <laughs> there, there's, there's some Italian stuff going on here. You know nothing about cuisine. <laughs> Got any gossip? We don't king shame. That is true. We do not king shame. We yes, do not king shame. About a Nortling who would replace crayfish with pike. Oh, Ask come a on. Question. Hmm. And the tactless one. I do not if drop on my clients. Let me get my water bottle. I certainly don't repeat anything I chance to hear. God, my poor legs. About two days ago, I did a workout. Two days ago, maybe even three at this stage. I did leg day. And I have not recovered. I did, uh... What are they called? Not leg drops. What are they called again? The workout for the back of the legs. Deadlifts. There we go. I did a bunch of deadlifts and oh my god, I cannot walk. Lads, it's just so weird because deadlifts feel like the easiest workout ever and they hurt so badly the next day. So badly. <laughs> I don't understand. I can't walk. Ooh. A werewolf. Sweers. Choose one card from your discard and play it instantly. Whatever, I'll just buy all of them. Ooh, what's this? Is that a brownie? No, it's a hair pate. I don't know how I feel about that personally. Ooh, what's this? Come on, bear! Oh! Come on, bear! Sorry. I'm gonna buy one. Maybe we'll find some. Oh, that was the Goliath trophy we had earlier. Let me sell some saddlebags and stuff.
Hi, Lana. How you doing? How you getting on? Okay, are you ready, guys? We're par we're about to play the most important part of the game. It's time to do the main quest. It's Not time likely for to taste your famous fisherman. You put an ethical issues out of so mind before it. Yeah, it. ethical issues aside, pate is one of the best things in the world. It sucks though. Like, here's the thing. When I was a vegetarian, um, it's not meat that made me like, oh, oh, meat is difficult. Do you know what it was? It was like, it was pate. It was um, sausages, like um, uh, like the Spanish fuet, like all of those kind of things. Those are the things that made me miss meat. Like, no, it wasn't just like the, the chicken or the beef or the steak that you'd have with your dinner. That I didn't care about that. It was the... It was the um, fermented or processed meat in, in, in or cured meat, I, I suppose, is probably the better way of saying it, that made me miss it the most. What made me miss the, that food the most? Gambling addiction. I don't have a gambling addiction. I don't know what you're on about. The music is different. Do you guys hear it? Wait, Skillige! Oh, cool! There's a new deck! The guy is playing uh, a new deck. Am I addicted? Makes me happy. Ah, it's Roach! <laughs> oh, cool, Skilliger. Will Tofu win? I'm playing Northern Realms and it's not my strongest. I should have probably played Nilf Guardian. Oh! <gasps> the opponent passed. Interesting. Oh my god, the music is so pretty! Gamba, 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 your points to see if will I win this game. Time to put my 100k in use, I guess. Uh oh. Uh oh. Do you have 100k already? Of toxic drop points? Holy shit, that's a lot of toxic drop points. I had 100k today. Congratulations, Cora. Whoop, whoop. You can now become a VIP. <laughs> oh, wait. Oh, wait. I have no. Yeah, poor Jay is broke. Poor J is broke AF, unfortunately. The music is so nice. Whoa, that's a cool, that's a cool card. The lever command broke me. Isn't that... Isn't that, um, whatchamacallit, your own doing? Didn't, weren't you the one who recommended the Lever Command, Jay? After 23k, so I'm doing well, I guess. True, true. Oh shit, what the fuck? Did you see what he just did? Shuffles all cars from each player's graveyard back into their decks. Oh my god. I just got my booty spanked there. I'm getting closer to becoming a Tofu millionaire. <gasps> What's that beast? He has a beast sign. What is going on? These new cards this guy has are incredible.
if I hadn't redeemed the 70. All right. <gasps> Lads, I'm actually getting my booty spanked here. What the fuck? What the fuck? Holy shit on a cracker. <gasps> Who's he? Is it Roach? It's Roach he summons. Oh man. Oh man. This is not looking good. Not looking good at all. Your opponent passed. He has two cards. Do I win this? I think I do. Because he passed. Okay, luckily we won that, but damn. Maybe I am a Ferengi, I don't know. Honestly, I want to know, I would love to look at the book of uh, the rules of acquisition. I was thinking about doing like a, a, a video. I, ooh, clan drum and shield me. I was What's thinking about doing a video about that. Speaking of... Do you know my YouTube video about the sci-fi, the FTL? I have a command for it, I think. If I'm not mistaken, we're over 500 views actually on it, so I'm so happy. To me, that's a success of a YouTube video. Let me see. FTL stands for fast. <gasps> it's even 600 views. To me, that's a really successful video. I'm so happy. My first, like, YouTube video for YouTube. Pretty proud of it. Congrats, Tofu. Sure. I know to some people that means nothing to some that mean but to me that to me I'm really really happy I'm really satisfied with that keep calm start no pros so maybe maybe I should do more sciencey sci-fi videos what do you think um, I actually just don't have any ideas, to be honest. I think that one was really nice, the way we collected. I felt it was a little bit original. Um, Sounds like a fight. After not, ma maybe some people did do a video like that, but I'd never seen anyone do a video like that, like compiling all the information. <gasps> it, was that a roach? <gasps> what the fuck? What the hell, Geralt? Still be here. <laughs> Wait, are you crawling? <laughs> Sorry. Torn open by man -like I wasn't sure what was happening there. Was he alive or dead? Not sure. Fangs. Busted ribs, blood from the ears. Took a solid hit. Oh. Massacred by a vampire. A vampire? Mickey Mara, though. Or a flutter. Bruxa. Gotta be. A Bruxa. <gasps> Ooh. I, I read about them. Woman from the inn was wearing this coat. They were in the Witcher books. Hi, Rosmali. No, we just started. In the cellar. Gotta be. So you're not missing anything just yet. A Bruxa? <laughs> I think I remember a Bruxa in in, in the books. Small bare feet, lead deeper into the cellar, fell down the stairs, broke his neck. Hurled against the wall with great force. Damn. I realized just how stylish a girl was. Do you like my glasses? Took a lot of strength to batter this down. Oh. Read the Broxa Beastery. Let's check her out. What would she be? She'd be a... Oh! A djinn. All right. <laughs> uh, insectoid, necrophages, ogres, relics, specters, vampires. There she is. Okay. Kind of creepy. It was in a Netflix... Oh, it was in a Netflix show as well. If you must travel through the woods, steer clear of any places where you can hear several different kinds of birds at once. This, oh, yes, this was in a book. It, 
If I remember correctly, this was in the first book, The Last Wish. I remember the bird thing. Okay. That sound means you're entering a Bruxus territory and can kiss your life farewell. Fortunately for us all, Bruxae are rare creatures. Most live far from population centers for they are greatly for their own safety and make the layers in places where they cannot be taken by surprise. Those who to the side live near men avoid crowds and emerge from their shelters only at night. When they do, one could almost mistake them for delayed travelers hurrying towards their night lodging, yet subtle details give them away. Their close ties to birds, their piercing voices, and the breathtaking speed of their movements. Honestly, it's her fingers that scare me the most. She also looks like the woman we saw in the bar. In the... Remember that bartender? That lady with the hood we saw earlier? She kind of looks like her. Bruxae dart from uncanny speed, and with their power of invisibility, they can easily... Oh shit, they're invisible. They can confuse opponents and attack unexpectedly or from behind. Thus, when fighting these vampires, the moon dust bomb is a great aid. While it cannot eliminate the vampire's invisibility altogether, it can make it easier to track its motions. Generous smearing of vampire oil is also effective. Bruxa used her sharp claws to attack and can easily break through an opponent's guard by buffing him with a hail of blows from all directions. They will try to bite their prey and drink the blood once it's weakened, so every witcher who expects to counter such a monster should swallow a black blood potion beforehand. Bruxae are known for their sonic attacks, which knocks down and stuns their prey. Okay, so Yurden, black blood, vampire oil, and moon dust. Black blood and moon dust could be lifesavers. Let's go into alchemy. I haven't made anything in a while. I guess I don't actually have all the parts. Yeah, I'm missing a lot of parts, it seems. Superior moon dust. Oh, I don't have a blow ball, really? Isn't that just dandelion? W w since when are they called blow balls? Is that a new thing? Has anyone ever heard of that before? Oh, that's the world map. So this is a new map, by the way. Um. Two seconds. I guess calling them a dandelion in this game would have called. <laughs> I I didn't even think about that, Nas. You might actually be onto something. <laughs> Okay, so let me look at my inventory. What was it called? Black blood I needed? Oh, like this is so confusing. How am I ever supposed to find the potion I need? Black blood, there we go. Increases critical damage when attacking from behind. Psh. Each sign cast increases stamina generation for the remainder of the fight. Ooh, that, that sounds fun. I'll take that. Black blood is equal to black. True, but like, if you're looking you're for most of the green. potions, it's quite tough to look through it. Yeah, the sorting is strange, I would say. It's a bit unfair, I feel. Hi, Tofu. Hi, chat. Hi, Mazdino. You're here early. You're not usually here this early. <gasps> oh boy. Here comes you the booba. Saw you at the Oh, end. it was her. The lady at the inn. I know what you are. Don't know why you killed these people though. Clearly wasn't for their blood. There's a ring on it. What 
the hell? Sorry, Mestino, I'm not meaning to call you out, but what the hell is that? Does Did anyone know you could do that? Huh? What streak reached? Interesting. Sorry to interrupt, I didn't mean to. Oh boy. Sorry. I was not looking. I... We don't have to fight. You are wrong. Interesting. That's cool. I cannot let you leave. Oh no, can you go back to the other form? You were nicer in the other form. Oh boy. Alright, let's uh, put some vampire oil. Superior vampire oil. We don't fight, okay? Exactly. Now we have to fight. That's interesting though that you guys have the option to share it. Thank you so much for Massino for having a 10 stream streak. Let's go! It's like Duolingo now. You, you have to watch the stream otherwise. Otherwise. Sonic Boom. Oh, I forgot to burn her. Igni seems good, actually. Okay, so she killed all the men to get... Oh, to get to the body. This is the guy who got murdered earlier. Uh, What's wrong with it? Stinks. Briar from Wish. Oh my god. Amputated. Body was quartered just as I thought. Body was quartered? Wait, so this wasn't a monster who did it? It was done by a human? Third hand. A spare. <laughs> Except it's clearly not the victim's. Guardsmen must have not noticed it as they picked everything up. How is this possible? Still warm. Blood still flowing. Several monster species can regenerate. Never heard of that happening to their severed <gasps> limbs, though. Or of their limbs seeming completely alive after so much time. That is creepy. More closely later. I learned something. No, don't put that hand into her pocket! Ew! Ew, we put a gross live hand into her pocket. That's just creepy. Uh, ew. Ew. Laid in water for some time. Ew. Head swollen, and something took a few bites out of it. Hmm. Something in the throat. Are we looking into his throat? That is sound good. Bulging with coins. Wait, in his head? Pouch filled Florence, with thorns. From several different provinces. If the murderer did this, means we're dealing with a sentient thinking beast. What the fuck? Who puts coins into someone's head? Body was That's a waste of coin. Waste of good coin. Blows struck with great force, but bones sliced through, not, not crushed. crushed. Creature that killed him had long claws, sharp as a witcher's blade. First sank its claws into the victim's heart. No, Bruxa did this. Why not? You think so, a woman can't do that, girl? It was clearly a monster, but not a Bruxa. But then why'd the Bruxa come here for the severed hand? And who does the hand belong to? Why the hell's it still warm? Now, out shoved down the victim's throat. Mate, like a friend like Adam's pieces? family. Oh yeah, we can have our own hand. A, a little pet that perches on our shoulder. No answer so far. 
need to it's know not a bad idea, Thelian. I'll ask Palmerin to get me in to see the Duchess. Let me meditate because uh, I'm high on drugs. There's a path this way as well. I wonder if this leads anywhere. Nope, and there's not even any good loot! Psh. There's never any good enough loot. This whole place is pretty, but it ain't no loot. Ain't no sunshine when she's gone. Found of a lot of bees around here. Does it even ever get dark here? Is nighttime a thing in this place? Because it's constantly uber super bright. And we did read that the brook says, come out at night. And for some reason, she slaughtered all those soldiers in the day. In the day. What's that? Ooh, is that a coliseum? I have a fierce wish to fight fiercely in your name and fiercely ask your permission to so do. My permission thus I grant you, sir. We Just shall come to the night with the town from his days at war. Yet the last for him he'd find and yearn had married days before. <laughs> I grant you permission to die, I know, right? What is going on? I have my tea ready here as well. All right, you scamps. Store is done. Go find your parents. But the Pomerin, what about the story of Riddick and the dragon? Riddick? Chronicles of Riddick? for another time. But take a good look at the man who stands before you now. This is Geralt of Rivia. The master witcher who lent his valiant hand to the defeat of the giant Goliath. Master Witcher, is it true virtue always trumps villainy? Not always. Could go either way. Sometimes virtue wins, sometimes villainy gets the upper hand. Still worth being good. story think back a decent man attracts other good folk makes friends he can count on a rogue well he can only count on other rogues and who would you rather have for a friend what's wrong with rogues i must agree now that will do for questions what's wrong with rogues that's like a really good D, &D character <laughs> Actually, it's well. Depends how you play it, I suppose. Speaking of D and D, I really need to play it again. If we hurry, we'll be in time to speak with her before the spectacle begins. They'll stab you in the back, but only if they're trying to kill you anyway. You know. Who's fighting? Elf guardian gladiators. Close, but not quite. As we'll soon see. <gasps> Someone's gonna fight a Shalemar? A Shalemar? On its tail to confuse it, slow it down. What effort is the problem? The beast is a gift from the Emperor, no less. Shouldn't torment the beast. How would you like to be dumped in an arena, blindfolded with a string of bells dancing from your ass? Pity a monster. You, a witcher. I slay monsters who are a threat to humans. You're out to humiliate one to entertain a crowd. <laughs> he looks no so cool. With the glasses, to be honest. A shale mar. That's really interesting. I haven't heard of this one. Oh. Who's going to fight the beast? Guillaume, a young man you met. Yeah. Mentioned he promised his heart's capture a monster trophy. Great love demands great sacrifices. Imagine! Imagine! Okay. <laughs> this kind of comes to this whole joke, you know? Uh, there, there's, 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 amongst, like, big podcast people, big 
talkers out there, they'll say things like, you know, what a woman brings to the table, what a man brings to the table and stuff like that, right? And there's 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 this big gender wars, like men don't do enough, women are complaining and getting too much. There's like this whole back and forth between the two sexes, basically, um, in relationships in the modern age. And just to highlight and just show the difference of the kind of life that existed back in the good old days that a lot of people refer. This is what you had to do to win the heart over your girl. You literally had to slaughter a beast that higher chance of you dying to just to have an opportunity to ask that lady's hand in marriage. And yet there are people who complain about paying for the dinner. The standards have changed ever so slightly. Just slightly. Slightly. Let's go. Let's go. My, uh... My School of Wolf medallion is permanently bugged. Glitching out the whole time. Oh, that poor crater is going to die, isn't he? He's going to get a freaking Ankylosaurus schmack across the face, isn't he? I dedicate my imminent victory to fair lady Vivian. Oh, oh they're pretty princesses. It's begun. The fight shall have to end first. We must wait. Why are you hurting the guy? Oh. oh, it looks like a giant armadillo. It's kind of cute. Oh no, it's so confused. Got a bad feeling about this. Looks like if Malphite and the Rift had it. <laughs> True. Uh oh. It. It's not confused anymore. Oh, dumbass. Goodbye. We have to help him. Wait, shouldn't he die in honor or something? <laughs> That's a great emote, Mastina. Everywhere, you know? His tail. His front looks quite hard, too. Where the hell did it go? Oh! Oh, nice! The witch awaited till the time was true, then twelve danced and spun. It's kind of cute to be honest, not gonna lie. Wait, is it underground? What's it doing? <gasps> he died! The Baron's dead! No! What? I couldn't protect him, he stood in the AoE like a moron! No, that's not my fault though! No team, that's not fair! 
how's I supposed to protect him from that? His racist strikes belly, servant cries ring aloud, blood transformed. Dumbass. Dead. Can I save Show him? Me what, you got. what am I supposed to do? Don't oh, no, 07 him yet. I'm gonna, I'm gonna revive him. Oh, I got him. Reload. Maybe he'll be alive. What do you think? Is he alive? Do you think he's dead? Defeated by Geralt of Rithia, master of the witchering trade. Behold, as the last gasps of life seep from the beast. I think I'm gonna have to load. He's dead, isn't he, guys? Master Geralt, do what you must. Finish the deed. He is dead, isn't he? suffered enough I don't see him yeah me neither is he dead I hope he's not the fight is done Christ be the victors oh wait they're on the ground beaten looking no they're alive I am not as nimble as in my younger years you fought bravely Thanks for your help. He's alive! Oh no. my god. The lot came damned close to dying. Thank goodness. I, I thought I, he was dead. Not hurt at all. Vivian? Smile as befits a hero and keep silent. Speech clearly paints you. She approaches. Looking while working. Hi, Daxter. Ooh, look at these beautiful ladies. Oh, I love their dresses. Talk. Vivian, you shall talk later in the medic's tent. Geralt, magnificent, breathtaking. They're Your so Grace. Pretty. We knew that to summon you was a brilliant idea. We are delighted. <gasps> oh, look at that side eye from the other blondie, though. Look at her. She's like, mm. you're not all that, though. There's a bit of spiciness going on in the royalty. I love the jewelry. I love the embroidery. Everything is so beautiful. Damn. Love the work that they did. Have you seen The Witcher Netflix show? I saw the first season and the first half of the second season, and then I hated it so much I never continued Ace. And I'm truly uh, honored. See to our young hero. Hop, hop. For we must make off with Geralt. We should talk. I love her hairdo, I think, We the had most. been long awaiting your arrival. Had nearly lost hope. Then suddenly... That blonde that one, there's something shady so about that blonde spectacular. one. Your grace. Shalemars are dangerous Does the Duchess' voice remind you of anyone? Knights in full plate armor. Nonsense. In Toussaint, knights have battled beasts for mere glory since time immemorial. True. That's not the main sorceress. The beautiful sorceress um, that taught Yennefer and all of them. I forget her name now. I'm sorry. I'm very bad with names. That's not her, is it? Guillaume suffered a few bumps, scars, and bruises, but in return gained eternal glory as he who slew the monster. Yeah. Oh, it's mm -hmm. it is. What about the crowd. Say Class. The vaulted into the stands. Would have been a massacre. Geralt. Though we value your fortuitous intervention in the arena, we would remind you your services have been retained, and as shall soon become clear, you will be generously compensated for completing another task altogether. Oh, th your this grace, is the contract as contract. well. I'd like to discuss it. Naturally, but not. Oh no, this is another contract. Sorry, this is the first contract we initially that was given. Him. He let the investigation pending your arrival. But wherever could he be? Come, we must find him. Okay. Yes, ma'am. It is her. Yeah. 
She, the actress for her is beautiful. There's something about the way like she stands and uh, like maybe it's just the act, the act of the actress basically. But the way she stands poised and speaks and projects herself, um, there's something like she was meant for that role to be a sorceress. Does that make sense? Uh, I thought she did a phenomenal job in Tell the Netflix us, show. Have you come alone? Or did Viscount Julian accompany you? Wish to see Dandelion, your grace? Oh. Yes. I mean, no. <laughs> uh. Yes. But solely to tell him we regret. Yes, deeply regret rescinding the death sentence we so justly handed down upon him. Wait, he had a death fire, sentence on him? We would make certain he sat in a tower till he rotted. <laughs> no, sure he was broken on the wheel, then drawn, hanged, and quartered. Damn, what did he do? Did he sleep with all the maidens? Ah, the very man we would entrust with his... That does sound like Dandelion. Damien de Tour. Is this witcher a hitman? <laughs> Your grace. Witcher. Greetings. Sorry to have this to tell you. The song is so beautiful. It is, Vito. It's so wonderful. Body. I know already. Hi, Telfu. Hi, Rink. The creature in the cellar of Corvo Bianco. Was it the beast? <laughs> dipped his dingle no, in the Duchess then. Did he actually, a kind though? Of vampire. Not the beast, but tied to it in some way. You know this how? Through careful analysis of the evidence, both on the riverbank and at Corvo Bianco. Do you mean to insinuate the investigation thus far has been sloppy? Geralt insinuates nothing of the sort. We must listen to him attentively. Put his sausage in the royal pantry, Jesus Christ. How many more lines can you guys come up with? <laughs> I examined the body of the beast's last victim. Might have found something. Need to analyze it. A quiet place. That's what I could use most right now. And maybe the help of an alchemist or a mage. Also mm -hmm. like to hear all you know about the previous victims. Yes, he did. He Secret actually did. He slept with her. Oh, that. damn. Firstly, call me Damien. Please. Naughty, naughty dandelion. Secondly, you should know I spoke against summoning you here. I've heard much about you. You bring trouble, or thus far have, always. And we've enough Salami. trouble as it is. Yet we are capable of... I don't of like the flower the there. It looks weird. Without an outsider's help. I've no doubt about it. I feel it Damien, doesn't suit the armor that much on him. We settled the matter of the Witcher's employ some time past. Definitively. Since you have broached it, nonetheless. Let us discuss Geralt's pay. Are the legends true? Do witchers usually demand that which you find at home, yet did not expect? Oh, right. She's talking about the 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 wish, the first thing, the first new thing you come home to. Not quite, Your Grace. Law of surprise. Mm. It's something we invoke at times, but rarely. Usually, we just take gold. Disappointing. This law sounds rather romantic. Yes, law of surprise. Hand, it's a really interesting concept. To the I, I haven't like encountered this kind of lore. Oh, the fucking setting. Look at that. Um, other than in Witcher. I don't know if... Uh, I don't know if I've ever encountered this kind of idea. In any other fantasy book. Petitioners or a set of sample fabrics for a new dress. Poor rewards both. I fear you'd not have much use for any of the surprises we are likely to come upon. Thus, we've decided you shall receive the deed to a vineyard, Corvo Bianco, and the sum of coin. You will doubtless consider this adequate. The firm strong ladies. The title to the vineyard shall be given to you. That'll be your grave, Ace. That will be your grave. <laughs> the coin, however, will be yours only once you have slain the beast. Lovely, generous gesture, Your Grace. <sighs> Corvo Bianco. Isn't it the Duchy's temporary morgue? Is it now? So we get a house? The Chancellor is the things again, we fear. Not to be left on Tiny Toe to Home. Tiny Toe Home. Yet home. in its mood, a friend of ha Anna Henrietta. No, to a What's no more? I don't know. Nothing enhances a wine's reputation better than a grim legend. There's Thank a you, Your Grace. There I accept the, the contract, of course. But as I said before, I'll need some information. I have a question about baldness. Maybe we should ask this in wolf chats, but uh, in pathetic wolf's chat, but I don't want to be mean. Like, 
people who are bald, right? Is it a choice and or is it a style? And if is if it is a style, like how do you shave it to be bald? Like do you have to shave it every day? <laughs> is there anyone bald in the chat who has a who has a clean head? Can someone tell me how it works? <laughs> The love surprise is too easy. They're from Russian folklore. The oh, really? My uncle shaves it every day. Wait, you shave it every day? Oh. It's a style when it's no longer a choice. But the way I would, I would guess it works is that you usually, the way people choose it is that you start to ball somewhere and it's kind of like, ugh, either you get a toupee or you get some work done, or you fucking shave it all off. And I think that's what happens, that people just start balding in, in weird places, and then they decide, you know what, I'm gonna be bald, and they start shaving it fully. How did it start? Who was the first victim? Christy Hi, hello the Kubrick. First to die. Hello Super Snack, he by the way, He was famed well. once for his many glorious tournament victories. Then he grew old, hung up uh, his Bible, sword, sure. and took to wine making. Crespi was not Tell loved us, by the wine merchants. He was ruthless in business and thought to cheat many a time. He asked us for a dispensation from all court ceremonies. We did not grant it. We could not. Once you've taken the oath of a knight, you remain a knight till death. How'd he die? Where'd they find the body? Quite unusual, the circumstance. He was at a feast when suddenly one of his fellow feast goers noticed he was missing. Okay. The town watch found him an hour later. On his hands you and can knees, see this guy is shaved. against the town pillory. He's not his sword bald by choice. His neck. He had died of wounds inflicted with claws, not a weapon. Blows of great force. So he Hi, Commander Herda, how you doing? The body was on its knees, meaning someone posed it. So it seems. There's a bit of a glitch in that frame for some reason. Second murder. He's also we been know. seemingly shaved against as well. Yeah, looks. the scars. <laughs> no one reasonable ventures there after dark. Ramon Dulac's corpse was found in one such place. With the first murder, terror. What the hell's going the on city. with this freaking scene? Its inhabitants scene. grew wary, kept to safe areas. Ever since the new update, the 4.04 the update. Came to us from a group of concerned. Cut person. What game is this? This Criminal is Witcher 3. We're playing the DLC. Telling in a way. Blood and wine. Take it, you've excluded the possibility that Ramon died at the hands of these bandits. Do you believe me, an amateur? Not hands, but claws amateur. killed Ramon Dulac. The wound was deep. Do you say amateur or amateur? I always say amateur, a, ch a CH sound for some reason, which there's clearly no CH there. But um, yeah. Oh, see, look, look, this overlay. It's freaking glitching out even in the pause menu. Clean. You say amateur as well. Was mm. found in the gutter, dressed in nightshirt and I say with a ch. A pillow placed under his head, and his sword replaced by a bed warmer. Ramon de Lac, I love this a knight cup. who but a dozen years past was an advisor to our father, the Duke. Someone went to a lot of trouble to make him look ridiculous. Maybe revenge was the motive. It's not out of the question. Dulac had shady dealings with the criminal underworld, but no one ever came forth with concrete proof of any misdoings. Both so, older knights. First two victims were knights, best years behind them. The same could be said of the third. Sir There's Delacroix a third victim? was wont to claim that in modern times, knights face new challenges, enterprise being the latest addition. Oh, the so they become businessmen. He made a veritable fortune in the grain trade. Interesting. Palmer so this is like a money dealing Stinch. criminology Found a coin pouch happening on now. his body. Contained florins dating from various times, hailing from different provinces of the empire. Delacroix loved coin, true, but had no patience for numismatics. Numismatics? What does numismatics mean? Okay. How did I not know that you would show up here when you go and lurk? Wait, how did I know that you would show up? <laughs> I see. It's actually really interesting. Um, it seems a lot of us in the chat have very similar Twitch streamer communities. Um, like, I would say hello to someone and like they'd go on a break or they're playing something that, you know, um, 
that I don't want to spoil. So I jump out and I'll watch another stream and I'll see the same people. <laughs> so it'll be like Tara, Command and Herder, you know. Uh, we we would we would say hello to each other in different <laughs> different people's streams. You missed a, a new mismatics is the study of collection of currency. Okay, so if you're a coin collector, is that a thing? Is that how that works? Are you a person? Are you a new new mismatematician? <laughs> if you collect coins. <laughs> Lots of similarities between the victims. All the bodies were found in strange Sounds better than a coin collector, to be honest. Circumstances. Seems the murderer, whoever or whatever it is, is a small world, true. Convey. These were honorable men. We are horrified by the disdain. Basically, he said, I will. Which they were treated. Sorry, I'm going to pause because I'm interested in this Bible story and I must have missed something. There we go. Jephthah made a vow to the Lord. If you give the. Um, Ammoninities into my hand. Whatever comes out of the door of my house, meet me when I return in triumph from the Ammonites will be the Lord's and I will sacrifice it as a burnt. Basically, basically said I will even sacrifice my wife, son, daughter and newborn. Lovely. That's so sweet. That's so mm, lovely. Bible stories. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. These were Man. Of Toussaint. Blast it. Might be the point. The Bible has some say, really, really horror virtue. stories in there. Actually, like most uh, most scriptures have some scary ass shit in there, like really bad, terrifying stuff, right? And that is allowed in a school setting. And yet, some schools will ban books for having one naughty word in there, and that's a banned book. And it's kind of like, really, really. Considered, that's what the beast's trying to draw attention to. All the murdered men were knights who swore fealty, fealty to the to five chivalric sure. virtues. And even if knights of Toussaint swear fealty to what virtues exactly? Honor, wisdom, generosity, valor, and compassion. What the fuck? What kind of virtues are those? Fine I mean, virtues. they're fine. Why are they so important to your knights? Strange question. Your grace, forgive me. I'm a foreigner trying to <laughs> understand another land's customs. You are forgiven. According to legend, the virtues we cultivate were bestowed upon us by the Our Lady, Lady of, of the Lake. Lake. How we truly came to espouse them, none remember. In Toussaint, we believe men of low birth should be simple-hearted and obedient. We expect much more, however, of our knights. Oh. They are to be soldiers and courtiers, lords and servants. Thus, the need for clear moral guidelines. At the time different of laws stopping, for different people. A vows Lovely. To demonstrate throughout his life. Honor, wisdom, generosity, valor, and compassion. Beast seems to be pointing up moral decay, denouncing it. Victims were all humiliated. Might have been murdered to emphasize their lack of specific chivalric virtues. Honor, compromised by the pillory. Wisdom, wisdom by, by ridicule. Generosity by a coin pouch shoved down a throat. It seems to fit, true. Okay, so there's only two left perfectly. now. Can't discount the theory if it's on the lips of everyone in town. Say our reasoning's right. Next murder will be just as showy and denounce the victim's lack of the, the fourth, fourth virtue. virtue. Valor. valor. What really is we valor? Can also assume that victim will be an elder knight. Let's think. At the moment, all the knights are either at the tourney grounds or in the palace gardens. Our annual hare hunts shall begin there shortly. Have you heard of the custom? Milton mentioned something. Seemed excited to find <laughs> costume. Not sure why. I expect a fluffy little round bunny tail on his bum. If there is no fluffy bunny bum tail. I think valor is like strength or bravery. Yeah, so it's a bit strange why choose the word valor over others. Like... I have this like bone to pick with the English language a little bit. Let me explain. Um, you can define a word and you can use other words to define it. I understand it. But is there a difference between bravery and valor? Because I feel like in English, there's a lot of words that just mean the same thing and they don't have an essence behind it. Right? Um, how should I explain this? I'm trying to think about it. For example, in a lot of um, 
There's yeah, there's too many synonyms almost in the English language. Like, why do you have so many words that describe the exact same thing, but rather like maybe have the words have a slightly different definition? For example, uh, I'm I can't think on top of my head any other better example. It's not the best example in, in the Russian language. We would have different words for the word jealousy. We'd have two or three words for it, but they actually mean different things. There's jealousy when it comes to love. There's jealousy when there's come like vindictive, mean, nasty jealousy, and then there's the jealousy of white jealousy, where you're happy for them, but you wish you were kind of like. Um, that jealousy and envy again not exactly so the word jealousy would be used interchangeably in the conditions that i mentioned there between all of them um but yeah anyways that, that that's that's a small bone i have to pick with the english language there's too many words that mean the exact same thing there should be a little bit of a an essence to them but i think there is a history behind as to why that happens and that's because of the evolution of the english language is one of, it is quite an old language and a very well old documented language i think a lot of people uh don't realize just how well it was documented which is really interesting <laughs> the english language often doesn't yeah there's a lot of rule breaking in the english strange language strange circumstances a knight advanced in years the famed cowardice of rabbits could it be that simple is Milton the Peyrac Peyren the next and Again, maybe Valor has a better meaning, and I'm just nitpicking at it now, but I just mean in general in the English language. Maybe the example that I mentioned isn't the best. The Peyrac Peyren, Crespi, Delacroix, and Delac formed a knightly team. It was years ago, but... A knightly team? They were a team. What do you mean, an A-team? close friends, tightly knit, and as such earned the trust of our father, the Duke. We often witnessed him turn to them with delicate matters. Later, their paths diverged. Unlikely to be a coincidence. East must know it too. It's a lead, I'm sure. With the acts of heroism, while bravery is more often used to describe acts of courage in general. Okay. More positive and happy for them while jelly. Oh, I don't think so. Envy, I don't think, is positive, no? I know we can use envy positively, but I don't think envy is... It's a sin. It's a... Wait, am I, am, I, am I wrong? Isn't envy one of the... No, it's not one of the deadly sins. I'm getting confused now. No, I must be getting confused with the words. Your grace, we need to find... I thought envy was a really bad one. Rather problematic. <laughs> You see, the garden entertainments are due to start. I would say jealousy is the, the lower end hiding of it. Somewhere you see, this is the problem. Tipsy courtiers to find him. The hare's hiding place is a carefully guarded. Like, if I was talking to my friend and she had something really good happen to her that I wish had happened to me, I'm still happy for her, but I'd be jealous as well. And I know that jealous can be a mean thing, but I would still use the word jealousy. I would, uh, again... In Russian, we actually have proper words to associate this. But I, in my common speak English, I would say it's a white jealousy. I'm happy for her, absolutely. But I wish that also happened to me kind of thing. While envy, I feel like, is a stronger, more negative one. Maybe I've been using it wrong all my life. But I would say envy is a... a stronger feeling, a more vile feeling. We more problematic. Call off the game. I always thought, anyway. First and foremost, we must remain calm. Damien, order the guard. Discussion is interesting. But no, maybe By you're no right, Rosmali. I have no idea. I, I'm confused. Only incite the beast to strike sooner. If anyone knows me, I don't know enough English, clearly. Um, but it's interesting to talk about this kind of thing. My gardens, my night, I shall take the fall. A murder is out of the question. I will not allow it. Wow, not near look my at that palace. palace. Horses, ready our horses. Okay, so there's these big knights. Oh, your grace. Oh, <laughs> 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 oh my goodness, Geralt. God damn. God damn! What the hell? Why I should? Your Highness, I. Mind it doesn't get wrinkled. Damn, she works out.
Why was he holding on to this? Why was he fighting the ladies and waiting? <laughs> oh shit, I have to run. Okay, so there's five knights and they made like a hurdle, a, a circle of knights earlier. And it turns out that the three knights that have been murdered thus far have been members of that circle and they were advisors and like privateers. But then something happened between them. Something happened between them. And they fell apart, so I'm guessing that's something that happened between them is a sort of Jesus Tofu, don't run over the kids. Oh, look at the tree. Reminds me of. This kind of reminds me of Gondor. It's not the same structure, but the whole. Ah! Horsey! Same structure in a mountain kind of idea. Oh my god, this place is so pretty. Holy shit. Oh my god, look at the sunset! Pity. Oh my god, look yeah, at the mountains! Yeah, Hurry. yeah. Oh, sorry. We must go to where the game is being held. The participants okay. must find a unicorn's okay. horn, a golden fish, and a phoenix egg. With these in hand, they can deduce where the hare, Milton, hides. Me and we need to find those things too. We've no other option, but time is of the essence, so we shall have to break the rules. Damn. Quickly, gotta save Faramir! No! I would love to continue, but I'm actually like bursting to go to the bathroom. <laughs> Been drinking a lot of tea chat. So I'm just gonna run the ads and get rid of them. We'll be back in a couple of minutes. Um, I'm not going to grab any more. In Commander Tofu's footsteps, under her leadership. Would you like to know more? Why is my. Oh. I will edit that, Commander Herder. Thank you so much. If. If my mods can edit it, please go ahead, but I appreciate for spotting that command herder. Um, I have to go into stream elements. I'll do it later. Welcome back. Thank you. Thank you. Yes. Are we ready to continue? What do you think, guys? Is the red lipstick becoming a signature look for me on the stream? I've been, I feel like I've been using it for so long now. That uh, it's becoming a signature look now on this on this channel. <laughs> what do you think? Oh, wrong light. Don't like that blue light, and this is too warm. I like this light. This is the better light. There we go. Hi, Sandra. How are you getting on? Just came back from the wee break. Let's pour some more tea in. I kind of like using a teapot uh, because you fill it up, you know, with the uh, loose tea leaves. And um, as it gets to the bottom, not fully finished, it, it starts becoming too dark of a tea. Uh, but then you go downstairs and you refill it and that brews a little longer with the remaining of the tea leaves. And it mixes with the harder brewed tea from previous. I know I'm over explaining, but it makes the best tea for the longest time, I feel like in my in my professional tea expert opinion. <laughs> Signature of the tofu vampire is my red lipstick a tofu vampire move. The second floor, through here. Hmm. I shall show you where the hunt plays out. Then we will split up. You will get hold of Fa the fire fire engine red. And golden fish. But I nap the phoenix egg. That will be quickest. Golden fish. Do I need a rod or a net? Please, Geralt. It's not a real fish. Yeah, I know, but is it in the Look water? Up. Towards the water. See the lights? The hunters are trying to cook the fish from boats. You must simply dive in and find it. Okay. The that unicorn. seems reasonable. How do I catch it? It's terribly skittish, true, but I'm sure you will find a way to earn its trust. It turns around it's over there. Look. Wait, it's a horse for that. Golden fish and the horn both contain things or clues that will help us find. I did not know what I expected for a unicorn, but it's literally just a grey horse with a horn. Once you have fish and horn, find me among the other phoenix encounters. All clear? Then let's get to it. Okay. We're we're doing a treasure hunt, chat.
This is what my career has led me to. Doing a treasure hunt. I do encourage you to try it. Thank you, Jay. Appreciate it. How come Geralt is all surrounded of booty? Uh, as in, surrounded by booty? Like, good booty? He's a lucky man. That's for sure. Oh no! So it is stream elements, I wonder... It's okay if it's not working, I'll, I'll, I'll fix it in a little while. It didn't work. It did not work. No worries. I'll fix it. Excuse me, stop body blocking me, you people. Did someone just dive in the water? Perhaps that's the way to do it. What do you mean perhaps this is the way to do it? There's candy! Jay, I'm get getting all that candy for your blood, for after your blood work for you. You were looking for candy? I got you covered! I got you covered! Oh. You got the fish? Oh! <gasps> hey, wait. Stop, it's important. King Cormorant Sire, accept this offering we bring. Prithee cast upon us your merciful eye and bear before us its secrets. As the moon its heavenly course doth trace, in my domain I await that moment of grace when a soul of what? good or ill repute brings me a gift, fitting tribute. Don't cry, dear. The Duchess will hear of this. <laughs> I'm such a dick. Oh my god. Lul. Lul. Which will bring the trouble. What did I just watch? As in what I just stole? I smacked it. Smacked it away from his hands. And he never saw it coming. Why can't I run? Oh, there's a bug sometimes. If a cutscene happens while I'm in the Witcher senses, if I come out of the cutscene, it forces Witcher senses, which means I can't run fast and I can't do a whole lot of things. Don't re realize it in time, you know? I was confused for the longest time. I tried to walk up slowly to the horse. Perhaps an apple will work, or some sweets. We would not be in. If you ever want to catch a horse, by the way, like that, I have a recommendation. What you do is you get a bucket, like a plastic bucket, and I know you won't have like horse feed on hand ready. Just put a bunch of stones and clay in there, or like uh, like solid stuff, and then start shaking the bucket. That's how you catch a horse. In case anyone ever needs advice. <laughs> Ever, if you ever in future need to catch a horse like that that's running away from you, just get a bucket and put Dear a few sister, pebbles in there and shake it. Still They'll come virgin. running to you. Do you really wish to have this conversation again? Came Wait, did he just say what I thought he I just said? You spook the beast. We shall try this means. Hey, folks, gonna have to ruin your fun. Sorry. Oh, I'm gonna do Axie, aren't I? Who's that? Just use Axie. <laughs> Use your witcher sensors to find a treat for the horse. What the fuck? What the fuck? Thank you, Horse Whisperer. You're welcome. Roach likes carrots. Hey! One will too. 
<laughs> Roach likes it carrots. An outrage. An outrage, I tell you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's against the rules. You can bill me. <laughs> I like how the unicorn to a delicious crunchy carrot. I how the how like the unicorn is in inverted brackets or inverted commas. Unicorn. Thank you, game, for... Easy. Alright. Oh! We're riding a unicorn! Ah! Look at us go! I'm riding a unicorn! If you please, Your Grace. We do not please. We act out of the highest necessity. All shall be explained later. But it's against the rules. I am the rules. Geralt, at last. Got a key and a clue. And I've another. Yeah. Some yours. Who wrote this drivel? I begin like a groan, hollowed out with ease, then end like a mouse with a head of hard cheese. What the fuck does that even mean? I begin like a groan, hollowed with ease, and end like a mouse with a head of hard cheese. What the fuck? What kind of riddle is this? In a palace pantry, it's a greenhouse someplace cramped in a cave. I mean, I would say palace pantry, but I still don't understand how that riddle leads to it. Do you know what I mean? It seems a bit strange. Air velocity of a swallow. <laughs> hmm. I begin like a groan. Like, the reason I would say it's a palace pantry is because his stomach is groaning. Like, he's hungry. And then you end like a mouse with a head of hard cheese. It's not a greenhouse for sure. Focus on the words themselves rather than what they mean. I have no idea what that means. Uh, I'm so sorry, I don't understand. I don't understand your, your hints, guys. Maybe a cave? Hollowed out with ease. And then end like like a dead end of the mouse. And end like a mouse. Begin like a groan and end like a mouse. I have no idea. I don't get the riddle. I'm sorry. I'm gonna guess in a cave. Rooms, hollows. Could be a cave, I guess. Now let's just see. Look, if we take grow, hollow it out and fill it with ease. Oh lettuce, my God! We get green, then mouse, but starting with what heads heart cheese. Why it's greenhouse? <laughs> Pretty clever. And it sounds right to me. That's there are several green How was I supposed to solve that? What the fuck? And the key to it looks just like the one we found. Let's go. That's so difficult. 
God damn. Even if I knew, like, to look at the words themselves, like, the way you said, Nas, I still wouldn't have covered that. Like, I did start looking at the words. I... I wouldn't have guessed that. <gasps> Look at this claws. <gasps> oh my god. It's time to be Buffy the Vampire Slayer. Uh, what the butch? We're after Angel now. What was that? Also, unfortunately Milton is dead, I think. That reminds me of Pirates of the Caribbean scene. <laughs> yes, I'm playing this part. Hotevel Boucler. I'm here. Hello. This belong to you, maybe? <laughs> it did, but you may keep it. I've a new one. I do not know you. I've done you no harm. Yet first you butchered a Bruxer who was dear to me. Now you pursue me. Why? Bruxer killed, killed a bunch of people, at least. And you? How many innocents have you cut down? Many. It didn't but come in handy. Hey. You're the guilty, though. You're next. Hmm. I think not. You see, I've something to do still. More murders. Just one. <gasps> oh my God! His claws went so long uh, there. Not counting yours. <laughs> Oh boy. Oh god. Why don't they stay in their human form? They're so much nicer in their human looking form. Sorry, I'm gonna put oil. I'm gonna oil my sword. Is damage. Let me repair it really quick. <gasps> oh shit! Oh my god! My HP! What the hell? Was that me? I only have like two HP left. Shit. To stay where you were. Regenerate. I know you're in trouble. I can help. I'll help myself. No, he's my friend. <gasps> he has a hole in his chest. There's a hole in his chest. Yes, Geralt. It's me. Who is Regis? I... You all right? Regis? All is well. All's in order. Wounds such as these heal on vampires in moments. But we've not seen one another in ages, my friend. At least in human terms, that is. How's this even possible? Last I saw you... We... I was a bubbling, shapeless smear, having been rather spectacularly melted into a column of a certain castle. In somewhat better shape now, as you can see. Hardly peak for, mind you, but were I human, folk would think me a demigod, I dare say. I'm sorry. What happened? It was my fault. Never got a chance to apologize. 
No need, Geralt. Bygones. I did not have to join you on that expedition. No one twisted my arm. Why does that name seem familiar, Regis? Just a flesh wound. You are a liar. Miraculous regeneration. That holy comment always reminds me of uh, of uh, Harry Potter. Him? How? And what have you been doing all these years? Not the time nor place for such stories. I suspect we'll get a chance to speak at ease and at length later. Now, however, we must deal with the reason that brought us both here. <laughs> Local serial killer seems to obey you. Maybe you could talk him out of it, convince him to stop murdering. Why do you <laughs> think I'd come? It shall not be easy, as Detlaf can be rather stubborn. His name you is must Detlaf. certainly recall that neither do I surrender readily. So that's his name. He's your friend? You might call it that. Though Detlaf is, how would you humans put it, more bestial than I am. But not to worry. I'm working on him. Haven't exactly done a great job with that. He's killed one night since I got here, at least three others before I arrived. For good reason, I'm sure. Understand, Detlaf is not some decadent shit who kills for sport, or to assuage a dryness of throat or a dullness of mood. How can you be so sure? I'm pretty damn sure of that. I am, because I know him Did very well. Did he sire him or something? Despite appearances to the contrary, you two are quite alike. You've both noble hearts, yet you both are wont to perform ignoble deeds. When circumstances force you to, of course. Remember the year 964? <laughs> that was three centuries ago. Blind fear gripped Rivia, Lyria, and Spala. Women and children were dying. Their mutilated, dismembered corpses littered the fields. Brute of Lyria. Read about it. Chewed up almost 200, then fell to a common poacher supposedly armed with a dagger blessed by some prophet. It fell to Detlaf, <gasps> who then found a poacher asleep in the brush near his snares and dropped the fiend's corpse at his feet. And thus, a legend was born. So wait, Detlef... Detlef killed it but didn't take credit for it and he just gave it to a poacher randomly. Huh. Vampires rarely help humans. Must have had his own agenda, hunting the beast. You err. He slew it for one reason alone. The monster killed a lad who once in the street had offered Detlef an apple, expecting nothing in return. Terribly noble of him. You do not have a monopoly on altruism, my friend. <laughs> Vilgefort melted my body. Detlef found what was left. As per our codex, he had a choice. To leave me where I was, or to care for me and nurture my remains. He chose the latter. Regenerated me at no small expense in his own blood. Do you know what that means to a vampire? The gravity of the endeavor? Probably same thing it means to a human. You owe him your life. Much Similar. More than that. Mm. The act itself made us blood brethren. A bond so strong humans cannot even imagine, which is why I know something ill is afoot. Always had an overdeveloped sense of empathy. Each <laughs> vampire has a unique talent, one they hone over centuries. It's precisely what renders us so difficult to classify. Detlaf's trump card is his herd instinct, his tribal propensity. In point of fact, he prefers the company of lesser vampires and shuns that of humans. If he walks among you, Killing egregiously. It can only mean something's upset him. Immensely. Upset him? You shouldn't be slaughtering people in the millions, though. Anything specific? Some set of things that'd be likely to set him off? How should I say this? Detlaf doesn't understand men, their world, its rules, its conventions. He's naive in a sense. He doesn't comprehend your games, knows not. When you get what upset, no, Ace, I'm lie, not a man. Deceive. Suggesting he's maladjusted. Hashtag too soon. Venting his rage. I'm suggesting maladjustment can at times breed conflict. But is it the case this time? I cannot say. But intend to find out. Alright. Gotta find him before something upsets him even more. And all Probably worked in retail, blood. true. Well, we Working in retail really brings out your anger, things. doesn't it? Not entirely. I mean, when I find hey, Phoenix. Him, you know. I know you've a contract on his head. 
Yet your true task is to stop the beast killing, not necessarily ah, to kill the beast, am I right? All in all, sure. Let us find him. By the time we do, I hope I'll have convinced you Detlaf is no monster. Fine, all right already. But for now, evidence is stacking up against him. Hear that? The posse. Oh. Knights must have tracked me here. I prefer they not find me here. I'd makeshift quarters at Mer Lachey's Long Cemetery. We'll meet there. See you. Started Blood and Wine. Yeah, we just started today. Hi, Dinesh. Oh, that's cool. The other vampire had like a red smoke about him, and this vampire had like a black smoke about him. As fast as our courses would carry us, yet I fear we're late all the same. Pray, where is the beast? Still investigating. About to inspect this site. Withdraw your men before they trample all over the evidence. <clears throat> Sus, we must let the Witcher do his work. Milton's murder. It's actually interesting. I unfetched. don't really hear people say sir in plural, sirs. You know? I would not instinctually refer to a bunch of men in a room as sirs. Oh Jesus, I'm dying. Let's eat some cheese. Eat the cheese, eat the cheese. Now, is there something really cool here? A general thing that's good. Mm. Ooh, maybe we can put some alchemy stuff in here. Steady aim. If toxicity is bone one, time automatically slows when an enemy is about to perform a counterattack. Oh, that's a cool ability. I need to put points anyway, I think. So that I can, uh, can unlock more stuff here. Tissue. When consumed, mutagen decoction increases maximum vitality. Protective coating. Adds 5% against attacks from the monster time. The oil targets. Oh, that's actually handy. I like this. Seems good. Light armor's perk is OP. Is it, Sefi? What time are medium, light, or heavy? Uh, I don't know, actually. It's not heavy for sure. At the moment, it is light armor. I think generally I do have light armor. So you see there's a light armor that's... Is it in general? I do have undying. Yes. Oh, wait, I thought I was meant to uncover stuff. Oops. I thought I was doing, like, my spy stuff. We must allow the Witcher to ply his trade. You can have perk for light armor in the gen- it's in the general skeet. Okay, I'll have a look at it in a bit. the greenhouse? That's not the greenhouse. Ooh. Where's the greenhouse? You can't pull one over on me, Witcher. I can see your... Guts, my... <laughs> Hearing these guys talk in the um, the echo of the helmets of the what they're wearing. Have you ordered a new coat for the wine Oh, festival? is this it? Yes. The guard brings peace to our domains. This looks like it. Oh. Wait, is this not the greenhouse? I swear I thought that's the greenhouse. Unless there's more than one? Am I missing his body? Hmm. Guess there's more than one greenhouse? Gotta go back. 
can't pull one over on Where's the river again? You have the undying. If you cross the river and go to the building on your left. Okay, building on your left. So this is the river we crossed. Is this it, maybe? Maybe this is the greenhouse? Ah, it is! A hair mask. There we go. Oh, but where's the body? That's really sad. I really liked Milton. He had a nice character about him, you know? Very gentleman-y. I can't call... Roach! Roach won't come! He was a nice fella. Go up here. Um, although it's really beautiful the way they do these um, staircases and swirls and the towers and things like that, just from a spatial orientation perspective, I get confused very easily. <laughs> and I'm going to get lost a lot, I think. It does remind me so much of Gondor, though. In the the way it's laid out this way I am the king of Gondor and you heard it here on on this twitch chat in this twitch channel Ooh, it's a pink building is it pink it's pink I said nice nah, building sir sir a letter for you oh this is the what the game said who from can't rightly say sir I was just to deliver it I think he's waiting for a coin, isn't he? <laughs> the stamp says postage pay, so get lost. <laughs> Here. Thanks. No, sir. Thank you. And I truly hope I'll be off surface again. <laughs> Little shit standing there waiting for me to give his money. The postage was Dearest. paid. I suspect weighty affairs rather than merely the wine festival oh, that's have Jennifer. drawn you to Tucson. Perhaps you'll find time to probe a certain matter in spite of this. I recently came across the mention of one Professor Moreau, a scholar oh. in Beauclair, who conducted research into which... Oh well, mutations. times are hard, I suppose. Though the details are rather murky, as is the location of the scholar's laboratory, his journal could contain more information. It lies buried with him in his tomb. The music seems I not the map best I found in the book I have with the setting. On. Though I'm less than sure completely though. legible, I trust it will prove useful nonetheless. I felt this matter could prove of some importance to you. Thus I dispatched this letter. When are the delay. game of the year awards Whatever actually happening, decide, chap? When are they going to award and when is the ceremony going to be? Your yen. Hmm. The professor who studied which So if I didn't choose Yennefer as my lover. Um, would it be Triss who'd be talking to me now? Does anyone know how that plays out? Let me go to this notice board. Pick up all the Excellent. side quests. Nice too. Might be worth looking into. Oh. Let's look at all the quests we've picked up. Ooh. Whoa! 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 What the fuck? Where did all these side quests come from? What the fuck? What the fuck? Look at her! What? What the damn hell? Can't pull one over on me, Witcher. I can and there's a Gwent quest. I don't mind the Gwent this quest. Is oh my god, and another quest! The exhibition of the original dog An art curator. Please disperse! The exhibition is closed! Are those penises? 
Are those statues with little penises What's hanging? This about? Oh, let the to give me strength. I can't bear this, please. I believe I've been clear. No presentation today. Oh, wait. Are you not that famous witcher, Geralt of Rivia? I believe I have work for you. Saw your notice. Mentioned a monument. The matter is a delicate one, but mind you, I pay well. Unless I can say no more at this stage. Interested? What's this about? The statue. Disperse! Just tell me what's the problem. <laughs> a picture's worth a thousand words. More, I dare say. Come with me. I'll, I'll show, show you. you. A picture is worth a thousand words. They do they do be saying that. Here it is. Our pride and joy. Oh, look at them Reginald butt cheeks. Stalbury, a giant among lovers. A poking, puncturing swordsman. And atop all that, an unrifled tiddler of harps and <laughs> Tiddler of harps. <clears throat> Another organs. So what's wrong with it? How should I put this? It's lost its truth. <laughs> Somebody stole the testicles of the statue. What? No ordinary what the fuck? statue. <laughs> the sole monument made using a cast of the great Reginald's own genitals. Hmm. Certified and authenticated. Sprung directly from his loins, they grant <laughs> all who stroke them unparalleled virility. All who buy a ticket, that is. Thus, you must retrieve those stones. Literally. <gasps> oh, Lord Almighty. You've got my attention. Now tell me about this Reginald. No, oh, not no. the crown jewels. There's so much to tell. Legend has it he and the architect Faramont planned and laid out Beauclair. Personally, mm -hmm. I think... Wait. Impressed already. I was looking at his butt cheeks, but I think there's a penis hanging. When the camera goes from behind showing his butt cheeks... Literally and metaphorically. He later made frequent use of them himself. Not out of fear, mind you, but to avoid having to kill his rifles in duels. If the shot... Yeah, wait. Isn't that... Guys, do you see that line? It looks like there's a wiener <laughs> hanging down between his legs, but I think that's just his other thigh <laughs> with a bit of lighting. Got any suspects? Isn't the peep missing too? It looks like it, yeah. Do you think it's going to be a very well-endowed peep? What do you think, chat? Because I told you earlier that, um, you know, in ancient Greece, there's a reason why the penises are generally small. And that's because if you had a small penis, it meant you had a big brain. If you had a big wiener, it meant you were dumb as fuck. So, you know, that exclamation mark IQ test in the chat now holds a lot of interesting value now. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. It gives a lot of information about everyone in the chat who uses it. <laughs> Above average, Mistino. Above average. Oh, damn, Sefi! That is a big wiener. All right. <laughs> Stones were very much in place. Oh my goodness, this is a big competition happening in the chat now. Holy shit on a cracker. Them, them some big wieners there. There is some big wieners out there now. Kek W. <laughs> nice. That's probably one of the highest IQ I've ever seen. <laughs> I, I don't think I've seen anyone get 170 before. Oh, wow. That's impressive. <laughs> uh. <laughs> Sorry. Sorry. Need to look around. Might find a clue or two. Do what you must. As long as you return <laughs> grasping Reginald stones. Without them, Beauclair's entire tourist sector faces trying times. <laughs> trying times. All right, I'm gonna do this quest. I'm sorry, chat, but this quest is top priority. We must find this man's jewels. This man's jewels are of the top priority. Precision castration, I'd call this. <laughs> Precision castration. 
castration. Are you serious? Ooh, what's this blood? Stain. Oh, it's blood. Interesting. Don't worry, Reginald. Don't worry. Woo! That's a that is a very smart chat today. Interesting. Interesting. It will all work out. It must. <laughs> oh, there's something here. What's this? Even coat fabric caught on the nail. Heavy cologne. Heavy on cologne. Smell it'll lead me to the thief. The whole story where cologne is, anyway. Um, but um, why do we call men's? Is is cologne just men's perfume? Like, is it any different? It's just men's perfume, right? Ultimately. Am I wrong in saying that? Why the prophet's wounds? Or is it a does witch? it go on the face? Oh no, that's aftershave. No, I'm not sure. Cologne adds like fifty euro to the price to I see. So if it was called I man's know. perfume, it'd be affordable. And then you say cologne and it's suddenly more, way more expensive. What's this? Wanted murderous van de Gilder, Antoine Starling Stragen, Loth alias Halfbreed, Filbert Fourfingers von Witten. What's this? Never have you seen such a tournament, for such a tournament is never held. Okay, so this is the Gwent one. I think it's just yeah. So I was in I was actually in Cologne, beautiful city. Would love to go back. I don't usually say that I want to go back to any city. I'm ah. usually satisfied with whatever visit I got. Um, but Cologne is one that I'd like to visit again. Your reputation precedes you, Geralt. I think I might be going there next year. Maybe I might do a holiday. Very historic. Very beautiful. Very sad. Hey, don't you step on me. Oh. <laughs> really? Really video game? Oh, there's an alchemist over here. Oh, now I shall drink, dance, and repeat till the week. He's inside the building somewhere. Whatever, I'll go back to it. Sound leads to this door. Should I let them finish? I think they finished. Nope. Did they finish? Okay, no, they're going round two. I, I can't I can't wait for round two, guys. Sorry. They finished. Round two. Sorry to interrupt, I guess. This, this is not what it seems. <laughs> Word of honor. I, I, I tripped, rolled, and tumbled, and landed where she already lay. Psst! Hughes! That's not him! I, I swear, this is all an unfortunate coincidence. A series thereof. What? <sighs> that's not my husband. You mean, not... Not your husband? Who are you? And why are you in my home? Out! Now! Or I'll summon the guards! Tripping the next thing you know, you're ballsy. <laughs> <coughs> Calm down. Just here Excuse to talk. Me. I... Uh, I believe we have nothing to talk about. Mm, I don't we know. Do. We do. Just to kick things off. You're in great form for a man your age. <laughs> Geralt, you're one to talk! <laughs> Well, start the day with a glass of wine. That preserves a body wonderfully. Interesting. Might try. Did you hear that, ladies and gents in the chat? To preserve your body. To preserve your body, you start your day with a glass of wine. Take note. This is a very educational stream. I might have skipped my first science and technology segment in however long since I started it. But it is still an educational stream, mind you. Take notes, take notes. Say, 
Ever heard of Reginald Dobry? <laughs> his statue? <laughs> Everyone in the city's heard of it. Reginald's a This might help with my high IQ hero. problem. <laughs> Why should I... I would assume red wine. What do I do if I don't drink alcohol? I'm a, I'm a mummy at 50. Hmm. I don't know. I don't know. There's actually a lot of cultures that really do show how wine is used in medicine or alcohol is used in medicine. But I feel like... Let me think about what I'm about to say. There are definitely medicinal reasons why alcohol has been used throughout history. Uh, vodka in Russia and in a lot of Eastern European countries is like the base premise of all the the medicine. And a lot of medicine does include alcohol. For example, disinfectant is basically alcohol as well. Spirit, it's a bit different, but you know. But I wonder... Like, there are extremes of both of both uh, ends. There are definitely proven civilizations where they stay away from alcohol and they live very, very long lives. But then you look at countries like Italy and Spain, where they have really high... Um, um longevity long longevity they live very long and they do drink a lot of alcohol in those countries so there might be maybe it's not the alcohol the reason why they're living so long maybe it's got to do with other stuff culture food everything else but you know there are some correlations <laughs> i'm not convinced alcohol is medicinal quality so no, there, there, there is medicinal qualities in the sense that um, it's not like you drink a shot and it cures anything, but there is like a whole area about how it can it aids in a lot of um, cold, flus, things like that. Um, yeah, there is a a good few articles about it back back when I was looking into it. I don't know how much more updated it has become. This game, but the main characters made really did they? I don't think the main characters are that cringy in this game. Cut the bullshit, Hughes. You stole Reginald's testicles. Know that already. <laughs> I, uh, I can explain everything. My tea went up this... my nose. Rosalinda, I know you're in there. You had that fancy pants of yours. Oh no, not him too. This really is not my day. <gasps> Got you, you rogue! Prepare for a shellacking skeleton! What the hell's this? Yeah, a maybe like a placebo thing. effect, Ace. One, I could forgive you, but two at one time! Wait, oh, she has two? Nothing to do with this. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> I'm so blonde! I was like, two at one time? He, she, this is like her second boyfriend? I didn't realize the accusation was that I was... Yeah, sorry. Bit of a blonde moment there. For a fool, i teach you to fish in another man's pond. <laughs> I'm not gonna... Yeah, I want to see how this plays out. Down or you'll wind up picking your teeth up off the floor. I forgot I'm a man, you? Yuli. You can't judge me. Come here. I'm not used to being Come a man. On, you scamp. All right, we have to fight him. Cockled, cockled. <laughs> the name is brilliant as well. Ah, oh, this whole quest is so good. Also, how the fuck was I punching, punching? A guy with fucking armor know, like that. But that would have gone horribly for me had you not intervened. I thank you for saving my skin. I'm not, mm -hmm. I don't really care about so, you, sir. Time to talk. Uh, Rosalinda, my dove, please allow us a moment. Sorry, I was just fixing my mic a bit. All right. I admit I stole the stones. And the you will never believe it, but they work. Today, Rosalinda and I, well, three times and counting. 
Three times. Impressive. <laughs> At my age, that's more than the entire last decade. All the same, you <gasps> stole those stones and you gotta return them. Listen, perhaps we might strike a deal. Hmm? Let what me keep the stones. I'll pay you. Grant me this, I beg you. They... They've made me young again. I'm pimping out a statue's penis. Perhaps was a I, sentence I never thought I would say I in my life. Them to you for one more day. What would you say to that? A day is three more rumps at the least. You for deal, sir. I had to help the poor man out. Look, he's a bro. You know, you know what they say. <laughs> I literally just left. He did not waste a single second. Damn. Damn. Right. No, not a single second wasted there. The man is living a dream. He's living the. I don't know what dream it is he's living, but he's living someone's dream. It's a herbalist. Oh, it's a merchant? I thought it was a herbalist. Or maybe all the herbalists Whoa, are called merchants. A witcher! A serious client at last! You were there too long. <laughs> what do you need? Honeysuckle, Ganesha petals? Before he was fully out. Oh, yo, yo. <gasps> Gwent! How's business? Uh, the coin is good, but... No, 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 no. Maybe, maybe. Boredom. I know what my customers want before they open their mouths. Bolt men, birch, birch sap. sap. Ladies of all walks, whatever fragrance. Uh, Yuli, I know you know Russian. Is birch, or if there's anyone else who knows Russian, birch, is that birioza? Is that the same thing? The time. If just once somebody would order Yeah, it is. Oh, Snack, you know, you, you know Russian as well? Show me what you've got in stock. Show me what you got. What I always found funny about Birch, uh, just to confirm what I had said before uh, a while back, we used to play, which I wouldn't mind reviving it, even the count that we have, we used to play Valheim. And Valheim was like, har so there's softwood and you have like a weak axe to harvest wood. And then Birch was hardwood. I was like, Birch is one of the softest woods out there. It was so weird that we used it as like it was classified under hardwood and you had to like get better tools to be able to farm it. I found it quite funny at the time anyway. Oh, what's this? Formula lesser from red to blue. Hmm. Interesting. I'm gonna buy these because I um I think I need these all the time. If I'm not mistaken. Cordial. What does the word cordial actually mean? Is it just concentrated drink? Because we have squash in my wadi here, and that's basically cordial, if I know. You know, uh, you know that you can color your arm. No, I did not know that. I haven't seen anything like that just yet. In the mood for a round of Gwent? It's good to know. We definitely have to unlock some cool armor. All right, I think it's time to play Gwent. Oh, <gasps> we have Skilliga deck. We don't have anything for the Skilliga deck yet. I'm guessing we have to build it, but that'll be fun. Dun, 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 dun. Petula is a scientific name. Sounds close to the Russian word. Oh, Beryoza is what it is. Oh, do we have a prediction? No, it ended this minute. <laughs> it's a widow and she also has a love affair with Dandelion. It seemed to have been revealed that Dandelion 
Dandelion did naughty things to the lady. Okay, I'm gonna I'm gonna try a Nilfgaard. I think Nilfgaard is my strongest deck. Hi Blade, how are you doing? Music is so good! Alright, Gamba, Gamba, Gamba chat. Gamba your points. Will I win this, uh, this game? What do you think? No, no, I'm still playing on normal Sefi. I mean, I lost yesterday, so... Oh, there's a mushroom! What does the mushroom do? Did you see that? He changed the dude into a freaking bear! That's so cool! Oh my god, that's class! I need to get this deck. Oh, I really want to fill up my skill get deck. Oh boy. Oh boy. Is he not going to bring out another front line? Because I'd love to use Scorch, but I don't want to empower my front line just yet either. So I'm in a bit of a bit of a problem here. Ooh. Interesting. Oh, this is a tough situation. Can't play two, two strong cards here. He's going to FF, isn't he? I should have known with the decoy that he was going to FF there. Damn it. I knew it in my heart. I should have just passed. Now I don't have the best best cards. That's okay. Mm. <laughs> Look at the burbs chirping. Is she gonna summon Roach? No, she didn't summon Roach. That do 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 didn't do a whole lot for us now, did it? Oh, when he decoys, it's a bear already. I think I might pass this and hope for the best next round. It's gonna be tough. Look at you spamming the burbs! Who's who's the mo whose streamer is that? I need to check it out. Fuck. That ability is amazing. That is a really good ability. Oh <gasps> wait! But there's thunder and lightning! Oh no! He has one card! He has one card! What is it? What is it? What is it? Show yourself! No! <laughs> De De I got wrecked. Oh my goodness. Damn. Hot damn. All right. That is an OP card. All right. I am going to go make myself a cup of tea and pee because I just got my booty, booty cheeks clapped. So I'll be back in a minute and we're going for round two. We're, Tofu's not going to give up. I'm going to keep fighting. I'm going to keep on fighting. 
Oh! Shot her in the face. We're going towards Ashley. Here! Here, ready, 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 rush. Here, ready, ready, rush. Here, boy. I believed in you. No. You sound like I betrayed you. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Welcome. I didn't mean to let you down. All right, let's try this. Oh, no, wrong button. Ah, feck. If Give me Gwent. In the mood for a round of Gwent? Round two. Here we go. Let's start the video game. Welcome back. Thank you. Thank you. Let's uh, let's keep going. Do 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 do. Look at me. I'm gonna give him a card, and he's gonna empower it. Woo! It's a big empowerment card. Ah, so that's what the bear does. So if you play a shaman or a druid, it empowers it. Well, Tofu win this time. Oh, there he goes, the mushroom. The mushroom man. Do you know what? Damn it, I shouldn't have done that. Whatever. I'm gonna use my decoy because he doesn't have spy cards anyway. I'm gonna let him win this one, guys. Get your points back! Gamba Gamba and get your points back. Oh, there comes series. I can't afford to forfeit this round. But that's okay, I'm gonna do Oh! Whew. Okay, we did that. That was huge. Big, big dick play. What is that? What bard is that? Drag Bondu. Damn, that is so strong. Skillica deck looks really, really good. It's kind of like mo it's kind of similar to a monster deck in a way. Well, not so much, I suppose, in the sense that it's not so melee heavy focused and summoning focused. <gasps> no, bastard. So I can't afford to lose, so I have to kind of go all out early. A little bit here. Berserker. Yeah, no, he only has one card left. Fuck. Damn it. Okay, um... I have to use these cards, unfortunately. I could lower- I could do Torrential Rain. Um, it lowers them by one point, basically, and maybe would have been a draw. Maybe I could have done that. <clears throat> I got make poop. Oh, fuck me! What the hell?! What am I supposed to do against that? What the- That passive! That passive! Oi, oi, oi. Welcome back, master. In the mood for a round of Gwent? Okay, I'm gonna do something else here now. I'm 
gonna try this now. I thought you'd won. I know. Same, but that resum. That was so fucking awful, honestly. I am so sad about that. Okay. Hello, Lord Nitrogen. It's tough, it's tough. It's okay, guys, we're gonna win this. This one, this is the one we do. I lost a lot of coin already on this. Oh, Fekker has decoy. That's okay, I have a decoy as well. I can use it to get another card if I want to. Surely this one. Surely we win this time, chat. Because I can defrost the front line. <laughs> defrost the front line. I can get rid of the front line if I want to here. Not a spy card actually, I didn't realize that. Ooh, I've scorched as well, pog. I'm gonna do torrential rain, weaken the back line. Scorch. I have I I can revive my front line then if I really wanted to. Maybe it's not such a big brain move. Oh. What the fuck? My TikTok just live access removed. For sexually suggestive content. What? Shocking and graphic content. Yeah, I'm submitting an appeal. What the hell? TikTok is just... Maybe the stone mission? It's just ridiculous. Like... Ugh, whatever. I give up on this. This thing is bullshit. Bullshit! What does that mean? I still only count as one. Basically, I'm not. I was streaming simultaneously on live TikTok, and they took away my account. They took away my life. Like I, I got banned, basically, for 
God knows for what reason. It could be... You're honestly right, Fish. I'm starting to think maybe it's... Maybe it's purposely done. Maybe someone is malicious behind the scenes. I wonder. Nah, it's 100% 100% is automated. Like but I got but I got blocked for violent content just now. I don't understand how my content was violent in any way. I submitted an appeal anyway. For graphic content, oh sorry. But sexually explicit is there so I got two there have been two different bans. I've I gotten banned for sexually explicit. And then there's graphic content. It is almost certainly the sex sense. Jesus, there are only three. All right, we won the game. Let's go. We managed to do it this time. A light long ship. It took three, four attempts. How many attempts did it take? Anyways, whatever. I'm gonna appeal it because this is getting ridiculous. I can't keep getting banned for playing the game that I've listed on. That's the thing that's pissing me off. Is that, for example, when I'm streaming on Witcher. Sorry, uh, when I'm streaming on Twitch. I tag that I'm streaming Witcher 3. And then the gate, it automatically knows what Witcher 3 is. Like it, like I, and I do the same for TikTok. When I go live on TikTok, I show that I'm going to be streaming, um, that I'm streaming under the category of Witcher 3. How can you be banning me when you have Witcher 3 as your category? It's ridiculous. Ridiculous, I say. Sorry, I'm getting sassy with it now. Also, I waited a whole day because I want to go and finish the quest. Twitch is a platform built for gaming. TikTok. No, but but they have a gaming category and they have like literally which are li like they have a list of games listed under that you have to, you you like I could also be reported for like untruthful listing if that makes sense. Does that make sense? Um. So I don't know, That's that still feels like TikTok should be allowing the stream to go through. Hi, Brute Force. Alright. Give me them stones. Give me I'm them back. stones. Shh, shh, shh. Not so loud. You wake her. She'll want another go. Wake who? Rosalinda? Uh, Louisa, her cousin. <laughs> She's... She's voracious, got an inexhaustible appetite, but I'm tapped out. What's it matter that the spirit is willing when the flesh is simply spent? <laughs> my heart knew not part of my chest last time. Here, you must take the testes. Oh my goodness. I grant your strength, as I dare say you will need it. Damn! Damn! What can I do? Poggers. Well, we. I think this was a win-win. We are completing the quest. We got the testicle back. The testicles back. We also gave the guy everything he wanted. He tapped himself out so much that he didn't even want the testicles anymore. So, banquets and wine. Oh. I think a win's a win. A win's a win. 
no particular reason why. None at all. I'm sure there's no re reason why. I'm sure Yennefer would be very happy to see us. Well, oh, yeah, there's a lot of people who stream jokes. games. Yep. Maybe Got maybe it back. just depends what you get yeah, recommended, you but I see a lot of TikTok streamers and they have thousands of viewers. It's really them. The big streamers anyway. Reward, nonetheless conveys the extent of my I see a lot of streamers play stream. And look in on us tomorrow for it the It does seem to be reopening. quite viable. You shall stroke Reginald at no charge on the house. I would be happy to see Yen. I'm sure you would be. Goodness gracious, great balls of granite. <laughs> I'm sure the storytellers were very, very excited, <clears throat> no pun intended, to um, to be writing these stories. Stroke the balls. They attached. Oh! Oh god, seeing the hammer. You might be here a while, guys. Personally, seeing a hammer in that area makes it ever so slightly uncomfortable to look at. It's uncomfortable to watch. I was thinking, I was, like, and I don't even have balls, so I was My assuming that it might be worse for you guys, for you gentlemen in the chat. Uh, this pub seems a little quiet. Maybe it's morning time. The Move the camera too if it hurts. Toussaint is home to the best wines in the world. And I've the best wines in Toussaint. This is just going to be Gwent Simulator chat now. We Come have a new Gwent, Gwent quest. Prices are the best this side of the Yaruga. Let's go. Bum, 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 bum. Bum, 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 bum. You may not have balls, but you have empathy. <laughs> That's an interesting way to put it. Okay, so we have a spy card. We'll use that early. Uh, oh, two decoy cards. Lovely. Damn it. Can't decoy that. World Sofa win. <laughs> All these gamba gambas. Place your money, place your bets. Place all your heart and junk in content. I'm not sure why that rhymed and why I was forcing a rhyme there. Just bear with me. Aha! How do you like them apples? Ooh. Is he gonna summon Roach? How about this? Kapla! <laughs> Bye, Roach! Really, I'm just taking Roach back for myself. I'm gonna decoy that, actually. Take it back. I think the other music is better in Gwent, the OG music, but this is still nice, you know? It's nice for a change of pace. But damn, they narrated a whole like sets set of audio for this expansion pack that's amazing and for gwent as well not just for the missions and stuff for gwent for gwent do 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 For Gwent! This fucking thing is insane. 
Like, it's insane, that power- that- the power of that card is crazy. I'm sure I have to fight a final boss or something for that- that last card. She is so powerful. That is not the good, that is not a good two cards to have in the end. All right, we win these. Easy clap. I suppose after the last opponent, opponent, this is easy enough. We got Olaf. I hope you don't confuse him with Olaf from League of Legends because we do not want that Olaf running down at us. Nope, 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 nope. Beware. Got a text message from about a possible part time job, which sounds honestly amazing. A proposition. I'm gonna. I might have to hop off during stream just for 10 minutes for a phone call at some point. So don't be startled if I have to do that. But I might be getting a call about a small project with a little bit of part time job work. Working from home as well, which is brilliant. Yeah, honestly, I think that would be amazing. I would love, I would love to have a part time job just for a bit of financial stability and still work on doing full time content, you know, streaming and, um, making youtube videos now that i did my first youtube video i'm so you know excited about uh possibly making more youtube video but i just don't have any more ideas that uh that sci-fi one was really interesting and comprehensive and i felt like it was original like i said but i don't know i don't know what other original videos i could do i'm not a very original person i had some like ideas about maybe some energy storage ideas like, it sounds weird, but energy, sci-fi, and uh, the energy Quickly. storage in sci-fi, but that sounds very I must speak to you. tough, doesn't it? Your wound Good luck. Well, we'll see, better. we'll see. I have to listen what the job proposition is, but it's it is work from home anyway, and it is part-time, so I'm time. definitely going to look into it. To be it. frank, that is precisely why I wish to speak with you. Want me to stand in for you? Take on some trouble on your behalf? That could very well be the case. You see, there is a maiden, nay, a lady. I suspect someone's cast an ill spell upon her. A curse, perhaps. Oh? Is this man in love with the lady and he wants me to save his damsel in distress? Save your own damsel in distress. Leave me out of it. Let me guess. She suddenly grew cold, haughty, and distant, though the night before she was flirtatious and alluring. Tut tut, Witcher. You jest, tut -tut. yet the matter is grave. Though true, the lady <laughs> is dear to my heart. I shall not deny it. <laughs> I fear she has fallen victim to ill magic and knows no one she could turn to for help. What, why do you think she's cursed? What makes you think she might be cursed? You must keep all I say to yourself, I beg you. I would never dare to be so indiscreet normally, yet I'm troubled about her, for her. His hand is bandaged up. Vivian shuns the company of others. Though the fairest maid at court, she keeps men at a distance. I thus determined I would resort to trickery. Trickery? That even befitting of a knight? In war, yes. And what is love if not battle? As it and were, what is love if not battle, chat? Outside her seamstress's home. As Vivian emerged from it, I too emerged. Ever so gently but convincingly collided with her, then promptly offered to escort her home. She consented. At first, all argued well. I proposed a more serious... Do you hear that chat? He consented. This was in the 13th century, and this gentleman is talking about consent. Ahead of his times, I say. Ahead of his times. She agreed. I made kindly forays into conversation, 
and she even began to respond as we neared the end of our route. Then suddenly... Then suddenly, mid-speech, from her mouth there flew a most hideous shriek. I stopped stone cold in my tracks while she turned red and the end of the world off. movies and series and the <gasps> I did not give chase that time. Yeah, Jay. I attempted to approach her. That is such a good idea. You are a genius. Okay, we need to pet the Jay in the chat. Pull out your pet the Jays. Where is my pet the Jay? Ooh, ooh that. <laughs> Where's my pet the J? No! How do I get my pet? I don't think I can do it in this overlay. Damn it! I need my pet the J. That is a brilliant idea. To learn Thank you, Mastina, for covering me. I feared she had become entangled in some trouble. I love I that idea, J. That, that is so good. Night, she ventures into the woods, where I've seen her walk about a glade near a pool. I've striven on occasion <laughs> to follow her, but lost track each time. It seemed then she'd melted into the air. Notice any other strange behavior? Additional symptoms? No. I Vivian's love that idea, Jay. I think that's something we should look encounter. into. But folk gossip. Absolutely. We'll start doing the science and technology segment. They say on that. she's secretive, that no one ever sees her after dusk, that she's wont to suddenly disappear. Nothing unusual about any of that. Sound you heard. She might have just had a sore throat. Had I thought it possible the sound was natural, I never would have taken up your precious time. Tell me more about Vivian. Who is she? What's her story? She's I her definitely look like I'm doing CSI. Her mother was a lady in waiting. With those father, glasses and the deep husky voice. That and is these all angles. I've learned, for the Duquesa grows angry when asked about her. Vivian all we need is that the ending of every walls. mystery we solve. If we are in luck. We need a, a, pun, a punny, a punny, a punny line. Thus, each participant will be granted an audience with her. Got a problem then? See, I'm not a participant. I've devised a solution already. You should take my place in the lists and thus gain the chance to speak to her. I was looking forward to winning the tourney, very much so. Yet for Vivian, I am prepared to sacrifice anything. What's this tournament? This tourney. How's it work exactly? It is the year's grandest and the most important contest. Knights from all corners come to face off for the grand prize, and more importantly, for glory. A demanding test of knightly prowess in horsemanship, marksmanship, and fencing. I qualified for the first time, had great hopes of winning. Aww. Yet... Yeah, I get it. Anything for Vivian. Hardly She's a regular always job, this. <laughs> Not often I gotta take part in a tourney to fulfill a contract. <laughs> he can't be anything ordinary either. I'm no magnet to command heaps of coin, but naturally I shall award you a just amount. How much do you demand? Ooh, that's nice gold. Maybe we can stretch it to seventy-five. I'm gonna, I'm gonna chance my arm here. Agreed. Oh, an amount I, I should have chanced more of my arm. He's, he's a man in love. He's a man in love. We should have. Exploited that. Fine, I'll look into it. Gotta admit, piqued my curiosity. I shall be forever in your debt. Now, we must ensure you are not eliminated from the tourney before you can meet Vivian. Meaning? Could you show me how you shoot, ride, and fight, perchance? And you must learn the tourney rules, know how to apply them in practice. <laughs> okay, this, I, I uh, this is going to be a fun side abilities. quest. You Everyone can steal his girlfriend, will we steal his witcher. girlfriend? Besides, the tourney contests must surely differ. Require skills you don't usually apply. Races above all. The choice is yours. Where shall we start? Uh, target Mark's practice, I guess. Feel need to do some shooting. I, oh, I guess it's Come crossbow, right? The marksmanship contest shall pit Exploiting you a man in love. That's a good tagline, is it? He who hits Sorry. All his targets first oh, there's armor up there. My name's as good there. as that Cupid's who shot you. Sometimes when you speak, I miss the meaning. What do you mean sometimes when I speak, the meaning is lost entirely? You guys hit speak in riddles targets. and poems. You believe the from the a cow dropped from the sky in front 
Do I have to hit the shield or just anything? Wrong target. One point for your opponent. Oh, the blue ones aren't bad guys. I see. Sorry. I didn't realize. Once more. Done enough shooting. Okay, so I don't shoot the blue Where guys. If you wish to know my thoughts. Oh, what's I that you, alien species? The they're bl they're blue the aliens. Events. They call they call humans um Let's do pink faces. Roach will like that. I think. Excellent idea. Um They're Come in Alien you. Enterprise? It's been a long time since I watched that, but I don't remember what they're called. Something with A. The race differs from others you might have taken Trying to remember. Can anyone remember what the, the famous aliens opponent. are there? They How's have they have two man. tentacles and they wriggle time. around. The true track begins in the arena, runs round the tourney grounds, then finishes again in the arena. The training track, however, lies beyond the arena. We shall go there now. They don't seem to like the Vulcans. ready now listen for it can be quite the challenge along your route and dorians yes targets. the dummies thank you, you Rosemary. that's them blade. the targets you must hit from your crossbow the time oh, you shit. have to complete the course shall increase each time you land a strike be it with blade or bolt it may sound simple enough yet i've seen many a knight fail this contest and hang his head in shame this is really During tough proper, it's not just a horse race the course shall tally your damn points. For now, you may ride unperturbed by those matters. Hot oh, damn. This is tough. Mantica holding an attack mode trigger slow motion mode will make it easy for you. Okay. Slower. So we don't have to actually hit the dumb dummies if we don't want to. Did I miss? Ha! <laughs> Lul! Fabry, <laughs> thanks for the so, follow. Have you had enough, or do you wish to ride again? Uh, I've had enough. Had enough. Rather not wear my horse down before the real race. See different species really. I was thinking about how they have a same god make poop. It, ma it makes us think that we're dirty nice minded, but in reality, like a sweat. Very well. Yeah. We shall practice infantry combat one on one. Each knight opts for his own method. Rainfire, Personally, instance, that's like a little thing that I have. It's not the sex part that upsets me in Star Trek. Um, but I suppose I understand why they limited everything to being humanoids in Star Trek. Because, you know, CGI and all of that it was expensive at the time. So they really had to make do with costumes. And that's why most of the aliens were humanoids. But I was very surprised just how humanoid, humanoid majority of aliens were. You know, and the same size and everything. So it would have been cool if they... I don't know, did a lot more different aliens. For the Ferengi are awesome in that case. They're humanoids, but at least they're extremely different. With their shortness, with their characters, everything like that. Come with me. Come with me if you want to. You will team with other knights to fight. The clash simulates a true skirmish during battle. Come the end, you shall fight a duel. It will determine your place on the podium. I always liked the duels the best. But oh, now yeah? I can think only of my Vivian. In the end, it is good you will He talks me. about her all the time. This is what girls want. They want their men to be so in love that they just always talk about their girls. That's the dream. That's the dream. Where have you been? Stand at the center of the training ground. A knight will approach and challenge you. The knight's codex commands constant improvement. 
Slice! Smash! You will never learn. No mercy! Oh, I can't use, uh... I can't use... Spells. Oh, we both missed! Oh no, we didn't. It's a cutscene. Do you wish to practice fighting a moment longer? Not really. I think I've seen enough. Sorry to be blunt, but the simplest Witcher contract demands more skill than this kind of combat. Now you must go to the inscription tent. Honor and glory are all true and good, but your scrolls must be in order. These guys kind of remind me of that. I think it was one of the Until early episodes in the Netflix really show of Witcher. Honor. Remember they're going after that dragon episode, that golden dragon. Can't really good episode, by the way. Um, but it kind of reminds me of that, that night that went with them, One, that Yennefer two, was contracted three. to help with. Kind of found that funny. Oh, haircut time! Do we have a new haircut? Can we get a new haircut? Need a bit of grooming. <laughs> Gwent, maybe we could play around. <gasps> the way I'm shirtless sitting there. <gasps> oh, that's hilarious. That's why, like, I'm asking. Yeah, I loved the Asari race, Godman Pook. I really like that, yeah. <laughs> Hashtag priorities always, always lead to Gwent. <gasps> Gwent, you say? Gwent? Oh, feck's sakes, two decoys. I don't think I have even a good thing to withdraw. And they use Mysterious Elf. I'm so unlucky. We have our priorities sorted. Done. All right. <sighs> you can unlock new haircut by doing side quests after this tournament. I see. Do 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 do. Torrential downfall. I'm gonna basically force him to use cards. The problem is I don't actually have decoys, but like he's not using anything useful. I can't really do anything, so um, I'm just gonna use the decoys for the sake of forcing this guy to spend cards. I don't know if he's gonna keep playing here. He might FF here. I don't know. I have more energy, more energy, more like... <laughs> You've... Your mind is corrupted! You have a corrupted mind now, Jay, no! <gasps> no! The decoy! I wasted my decoys! No! Wait. Can I summon back a decoy? Damn it! I cannot summon back a decoy. Damn it. We need that voice line added. 
I need to I need to keep myself up to date with all the TikTok trends and keep updating my voice lines every day, every week. Every week I sit down and I update the voice lines. You know, I was late starting the stream. I didn't get a workout in. I didn't get a lot of stuff done this week. Could have used revive there. God damn it. Um, and I was thinking, you know, maybe I should switch my schedule and push it back to 1 p.m. starting the stream. But I'm going to be honest with you. If I push my stream back to 1 p.m., I'm just going to take advantage and I'm going to sleep in that extra hour. I'm not going to do anything useful for that hour. So I'm like, fuck it, Tofu. Get your shit together. Start. Start getting onto stream early and on time. So I need to do better. I got to do better. I just know myself too well. <gasps> That's an evil nasty scorch. Oh, but I think I win because I have Nilfgaardian. It draws a win. I would take the sleep. Yeah, that's the thing, like, so it doesn't matter if I'm like, oh, I'll, I want to start my streams at 1 p.m. instead, because I'll get more done during the day. I won't get done more. I just know myself. I won't get more done. Absolutely not. Need a bit of grooming. <laughs> Need a bit of grooming. Unkempt. I feel like there's more options here. Is there a new option here, do you think? Is my camera camera is my camera covering it up? Do you guys see? Is is any of these new options by any chance? Rebel cut, I think? Is it? Let's see it. I don't think so. I think the rebel cut is the weird spiky one. Oh wait! That does look newish. My time's up. So long. <laughs> I'm sorry, but I love it! Look at us! Look at that! Oh, come on! It's brilliant. I think I look great. I think I look fucking spectacular. There's a pint here, by the way. Maybe she plays Gwent. Did you kiss oh. a, a sweet shining sun? Noble woman, no, no. noble woman. Oh, <laughs> And keep. There we go. Welcome, welcome. Tell me what you'd like. No, shaved on the sides is definitely not new. I think. Um, I remember Around that one. Gwent, maybe. Because that was the one we kind of had earlier. Drink and be merry. Thus spake the prophet Lebiota. Oh, what? Tofu playing Gwent? What is this? I am so shocked. Oh my. Oh dear. Anyways. <laughs> moving on. These star girl fried chicken brand on the bow tie now. I don't want to win too hard either. Ooh, torrential rain. Sexy. I wonder why Triss Marigold is a frontliner, by the way. That seems weird as a sorceress, no? Am I looking too harshly into this? FF here. If he doesn't, he might FF here now. Ooh. Ooh. 
Oh yeah 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 yeah. Do you know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna put Frosty down here. Frosty the Snow Mage, and then maybe FF. I'll force him to play some cards. Oh, <gasps> ooh, that's a good card. He played that well. Hmm. I love how I say I'm going to FF and I never do. Next round, next round. I promise. I promise, chat. Next round, I'll FF. This has an Asian. The music has a quite a Asian tinge to it. That makes sense. I love the music. Yeah, you're saying it gets you passionate, more footwork, more artwork, <laughs> more energy. Why did I use that card? What the hell, Tofu? What were you thinking? You weren't thinking, that's what. Oi, oi, oi. I was not thinking. I was not thinking. My brain, my pea sized brain, I'm so sorry. It must be so embarrassing for you guys to witness this and say that you know me. <laughs> I still win. <laughs> I do not deserve to win here. And yet I do. And yet I do. Tofu prevails, despite all the odds. Shocking, I tell you. <sighs> okay, we've got a hundred crowns. A war long ship. Bastard. Bastard. Look at all the flowers. So many pretty flowers. Honestly, I know that people talk about how bad it is and impractical and stuff like that, but having a meadow in your backyard instead of like a lawn sounds like really cool. Wild flowers and stuff like that. Oh, I think that's the sign up, the signboard. I wish you health. <coughs> he says, coughing on me. Greetings. Want to join the lists? Naturally. We must first see to formalities, however. At Guillaume's request, I have looked into your personal history in its heraldic aspects. Really? Oh, yeah. What did you come up with? My findings show you may take part as Geralt of Rivia. What a surprise. <laughs> or as the Honorable Ravix of Forhorn. It's not every year we have a combatant who can boast of two crests. Which do you prefer? What? Who's Ravix of Fourhorn? Ravix of Fourhorn? How'd you manage to dig that up? Here in Toussaint, we treat heraldry very seriously. One visit to the Ducal Archives. That is all I needed to acquire the necessary information. Ravix of Fourhorn was the name under which you attended a feast honoring Princess Pavetta, <gasps> daughter of Queen Calanthe of Sintra, on the occasion of her 15th birthday. That's actually right. Oh! Damn! I'm Geralt, not about to fight under a false name. You may now take the shield bearing your crest. I have a I'm crest? A witcher. Shields aren't something witchers ever use in combat. Who mentioned using it in combat? Not I. The shield commemorates your participation in the tourney. You may take it as a souvenir. Why, uh, thank you. In that case, thanks. <laughs> Have you been instructed as to the tourney's challenges, prizes, and vows? If not, I do hope you will allow me to Doesn't he look like- He does look a little bit like the guy who did steal the penis. Wait, I have to have vows? I'm not promising to marry anyone. Vows? As is our custom, knights make vows to which they hold for the duration of the tourney. Each swears on something which to him represents his most cherished virtue. 
Cherished virtue? What's my most cherished virtue, chat? <laughs> Tofu's right lack of coming up with words. The winner of each contest shall receive a trophy. Whoever has the best result once all contests have played out shall face last year's champion in a, a final, final duel, duel for, for glory, glory and the title. Should you defeat the reigning champion, the grand prize will be yours. This year, a sword forged especially for this occasion by the one and only Cornelius of, of Asengard, Asengard, a famed master weaponsmith. Her illustrious highness had it brought all the way from Nazaire. Yeah, none of that means anything to me, sir. Uh, I know about the challenges. Feels like I know everything I'd ever want to know about chivalric tourneys. <laughs> Splendid. In that case, you must make your vow. Upon what? Yeah, what are we like going to swear, swear on, chat? I swear on the, on the heron. I swear on my lady's love. I swear on her illustrious highness's garter. <gasps> That's inappropriate, but also. I swear on her grace's illustrious garter to respect the chivalric virtues in competing. Uh oh, I don't May think he's gonna be happy. Oh wait! In your endeavors to overcome. The sign here, please. Then fill out these forms. That is all I need from you. Now, as arranged by Guillaume, you shall be. How is that okay? How did I not get a slap across the face for that? Hmm, shiny. You have also been assigned a tent for the tourney's duration. It stands near the arena. Okay, guys, Good we luck. are going to be a tofu night. <gasps> We're literally going to be tofu night. Tofu night was here earlier. <laughs> Hi, Moon. How are you doing? Look at my armor, chat. Geralt of Rivia. Take good It is time for Tofu Knight to be knighted. We look pretty cool with this haircut, guys. Well, I'll be. Have you decided to turn knight errant? <laughs> All jesting aside, here on a job. You in the 22? Am I? Ha! I shall square off against Rain Farn of Atre. I saw him just moments ago. A nervous wreck. Stuffing his, his nose, nose with, with fist texts, no doing less, cocaine! As if that would aid his determination. Guessing that's against the rules. But who's to tell the Nifgardian what to do? Oh, Listen, it's an Guardian. I have a tip for you. What's that? The timing of your marksmanship duel is such that you shall have the sun in your eyes. Makes no difference to me either way. Nor will it give you any pleasure. Since, as it is, we must both wait. Play me in a round of Quint. Should you win, I shall swap with you. To me, a southerner, the sun is no hindrance. Can we play, but Never instead... Can can uh, can you um give me a card? It's time for Gwent again, guys. This is just Gwent Simulator today. It seems it's just a Gwent Simulator gameplay. This is a new sound, no? New music. Ooh, some of these elves look really cool. The artwork. I was hoping he'd decoy my spy card, but I don't think he has decoy. So I'll just get rid of it. Oh, it doesn't matter actually. I don't have decoy, so nothing I can do. Tiny toe dance. We dancing to this jam. This is 
doesn't matter which one I do 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 so I'm just gonna do do do, do the back line interesting that only damaged you but okay I'm just gonna forfeit this round <laughs> the baby go dance I match your Triss Marigold. Dun, 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 dun. Um, but if we draw, I win. I win if we draw. I think this is GG. I'm confident. I am super confident. There's not a doubt in my mind I'm going to win this chat. Watch me. Watch this. Oh wait, I forgot something actually earlier. When I was beating the guys who were um, in keepers, I kind of smashed them and I moved on. But what I should have done was actually looked at their stuff and bought cards if I could from them. That was a mistake on my part. I should have done that. Well, you live and learn. Or in my case, you die and... In death we learn. All right, we won these. That guy wasn't very strong. Ooh, I like that emotion. We shall swap us agreed. We've passed the time rather nicely. Lady Fithian should appear forthwith. I'm off to face my first challenge. Good luck. Maybe I should have lost. I don't want him to get hurt, you know. Maybe I should take the brunt of the force. Fair knights, I salute you. The honor and duty of tourney patron have fallen to me this year. Fight honorably, so that I may bestow upon one of your number the tourney's grand prize. You have sworn that hair vows. ain't real. That hair you color, I'm just saying, that's dyed hair, soul. guys. The time there is no way someone has them. yellow hair like that. That's so bright yellow. Damn. Behold Horm Akispark of the Mechtian royal line. His name's quite the mouthful, a true challenge to rhyme. <laughs> His targets to be hit centrally and true are the ones in blue. Against him, new blood. You could have prepared a proper rhyme. Now, Sir Geralt of Riffia, give us a bow. That was a better rhyme. The targets he must with his quarrels thread are red. Okay, so I have to aim for red. I have to aim for red here. Hopefully I'm not colorblind. I'm sure I can do this. Let's go team. He has... Wait, I'm using a crossbow and that guy's using a, a bow and arrow. Isn't that cheating? Isn't that kind of cheating? Shouldn't I be using a bow and arrow as well? Pounded him soundly. <laughs> please, please don't be saying these kind of wordings. Oh. Ooh. Your prize, sir. A crossbow adorned with your crest. I congratulate you. Thank you, my lady. Thank you, my lady. So is this some someone we can also have? <gasps> my medallion hums when you're near. <gasps> Could you tell me about the other prizes? Alas, I cannot devote more time to you than to the She's other She's a politics. monster! Oh no! I have no. duties to attend to. Forgive me. My medallion's vibrating strongly. Can only mean one thing. Oh, magic. I thought magic. she was a monster. The explanation is disappointing, I'm afraid. 
the fragrance I use, it's mixed by a sorceress. To lose to an opponent She's such as you is a victory of its own. Accept my congratulations as well. Thanks. <laughs> he expected some poetic response and I was like, nah, thanks. Good work. In the interim, I managed to determine which tent Lady Vivian occupies. Perhaps you could find a clue within it. You're right. Vivian's cursed in some way. Sensed it when she opened the tourney. Oh. In that case, we've no time to lose. Let us go. Okay, okay. Yeah, He's serious. Now. Turns out there is something going on here. Before this we continue solving this crime, we need to empty our bladder before we continue. So we'll take a small P&T break chat and we'll be I got myself a snack. So I'm getting a little bit hungry. So I got myself a croissant. We're gonna eat a croissant while we're in Toussaint. Search. I should Welcome back. Like thank you. Thank you for waiting for me. Claw marks. That's clear. Not sure what beast left them. Just that it's big. Holy shit. Eyes within thy locks. Jar of concealing ointment. How will magic at work here? Concealing ointment. Like, is she concealing herself or? Oh! A honey croissant! Clothing's all dark green and yellow. Seems Yen's not the only one with a fixed color scheme. Is it wrong to have. Wait, Oreo is she feather. a sorceress? If you can keep a bird as a bet. No sign of it here, if so. Hmm. Hmm. Ruxay tend to be fond of birds. <gasps> Someone approaches quickly. A broxa? We shall speak later. We must return to the tourney now. It's it's time for the second contest. Sirs, what seeks you in my lady's tent? Inspiration? Be gone from here. Is she a Broxa? Why were you in there? Uh, tourney business. Now we know her bra is black and yellow. Like a bumblebee! Mm. White eggs. Dragon's eyes on the... Oh, this is the horse racing one. Behold, gallant knights and ladies decorous. Gaze at the host assembled before us. Look upon she. It's true, Broxas aren't magic, stories. but um. But, um, the ointment, he said, was magical. So maybe she's covering up that she, 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 she is a Bruxa. And then his medallion was uh, humming as well. And that doesn't just mean magic. It could be monsters as well. But, um, monsters are magical, if that makes sense. They came from the conjunct conjunction of the spheres, if, if I remember my lore correctly from reading the books, is that when the spheres collided, it was the passing of the two realms and magic came through and monsters came through. So I think his medallion rings in proximity of monsters and magic. Am I right in saying that? Can anyone confirm or deny come from what I've just lands, stated? Here to seek glory. Hear now their names as I shout them aloud. And that hair Speak color ain't real. That's definitely magic. <laughs> be proud. Hmm. Palmerin, the Baron of Lanthal. Lead us of Damn, Nicola. some of these horses though. Renfarn of Atra Home of a spark of Maked Dodimir of Troy Guy de Boisfren in service to the Duchess Delwyn of Craig Yow I love the Eye of Dondal the horse covers, and honestly. Of Lyria and Rivia, a prince. Oh, of Rivia. Geralt of Rivia. For Gregoire of Mount Gorgon, let out a roaring cheer. 
the faint flower of silence tawny champion from last year <laughs> today's winner of contests his victory to Maybe, secure, I'm not sure okay I had thought I had thought I had my lord down severe. does ignorance demand a part in deceit does someone need telling how tawny's proceed <laughs> the guy looking at me tourney for nobly born knights oh <gasps> Your knighthood came through the grace of my mother. You talk about nobility, Queen dude. You have a peacock Rivia, head, peacock tail, feather sticking out of your head. Later. Your presence here is an offense to my honor, and yours is an offense to my <laughs> eyes. If you're done, step aside, prince. Yeah, you tell him, Geralt. You tell him. Tony's protector, the mate Vivian. Her beauty entrances both beasts and men. She looks so unhappy. My heart's greetings, dear knights. May my grace guide you and show you the path of honor, valor, and glory. Accept my wishes of good fortune, sir, and devote all your strength. No head protection, to you losers. Yeah. Only it. The time has come for you, Sir Knight. Make sure Not if you do ride a horse, ladies and gents, you wear a helmet. Ladies Please protect your head. Your head is very important. Soon steeds shall swarm like ants, most industrious. To beat time's passage, they'll ride like the gale. What a sight to behold, what a luck, what a tale. What a luck, what a tale. Before us, Geralt, from Rithia come, fast as the wind, bright as the sun. Alrighty, let's mount up and saddle up, boys. Yeehaw! Wait. Did nothing happen there? Maybe I have to hit it. The water is so blue, Jesus. Holy smokes, that's very blue water. It is the best haircut. I don't know what you're on about. What the hell? How have I missed all of them? I cannot be this bad. I mean, I can. I get it. But Jesus. There we go. Oh, there's two paths. Not sure which path to take here, but I'll take one. Oh, there's the goats. I missed. I missed. No. This has gone terrible. Okay. <sighs> this is a lot harder than it looks, chat. I promise you. I'm not being silly. Well, I am, but like, it is a lot harder than it looks sometimes. Okay, we did it finally. Oh, Jesus Christ almighty. A race of such style, such grace, such speed. To watch was a pleasure, a treat indeed. indeed. To honor our entrance, praise each Tiny fair night. panic indeed. Shall feast from eve till dawn's first light. The finest of wine and food shall be served. If you've blood in your veins, come collect what's deserved. <laughs> Roach is going up to collect one. 
here. Look at the new Look saddle. A saddle adorned with your crest. Jesus, she boots. looks. So By the way, my mate saw angry. a man with white hair sneak out of my tent. Would you know who it might have been? No idea. <laughs> Wasn't me. How juvenile. Congratulations on your win. In stellar style, no less. Ah, I no longer regret I was not able to participate. Almost. We must drink to this. Come with me to the feast. We shall await Vivian together. Lead the way. I didn't find too much information. The male Karen haircut. Ugh. Do you not like it? I love it. Do you think it, that's the male version of the Karen? Isn't the man bun the Karen haircut? So, any thoughts on Vivian? Her For men, no? That is not what I ask. Still too early to say anything I'd be I thought people would by. say that the man bun Managed is considered... Managed to figure considered... one thing out. She uses powerful you know, magic. The Karen version. Illusions. Do you mean to say she might in truth look different? I'm so sorry, but can we look at the crest? Is that... Are they having sex? Look at Discord. Oh no, what did you do? What did you do? Gerald fried chicken. Oh my goodness, that's brilliant. Uh If anyone if anyone wants to check it out uh in the Discord, uh it's in general chat. Medjay created a beautiful work of art. Beautiful is definitely the word I want to use here. Yep, 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 yep. <laughs> Your inspiration strikes you in very strange ways, uh, Medjay. Very, very strange ways. No judge, no judge, but it is still very strange. <laughs> and there's two swords on the back. This is... This is this is what Medjay has created. Fantastic. Thank you so much, Jay. Gerald Fried Chicken. <laughs> Only guessing Inspiration right strikes you very strangely, clues. Jay, I will but say. I very, very odd. But we don't Bruxa. judge here. Usually. You mean a Vampiress? Yes, a vampiress. Not sure yet. We've still some time Hi, before Snare. Vivian arrives. Let us drink. <laughs> to Vivian, may you find the means to aid her. To Vivian. I'm gonna be poisoned uh, here, aren't I? When I first laid eyes on her, I finally understood what all those poems and ballads were trying to say. Love's not poetry alone. Sometimes it's prose, and sometimes it's just plain ugly. Damn. You say that the only girl's coming out with the big, big advice. Do, a life with her would be sweetness itself. Actually, you don't know her all that well. <laughs> oh? What the fuck? Her presence at this tourney is an affront to my honor. I demand satisfaction. The fuck? Head to the nearest brothel then. <laughs> Coward. Mounted combat in the main arena. I challenge you. Some other time, Got bitch. I'm busy. To finish here. We'll duel another day. You cannot refuse another man's challenge. It is dishonorable. You would be excluded from the what? tourney. What? Then what will become of Vivian? Coward. Fine. Main arena. See you there. But I'll never get anything done if people just challenge me left and right, no? Like, if, if people can just challenge me on a whim, I'll just never get any of my work done. It's an affront to chat as well. I will spill, wash away the stain of your cowardice. Let's get this over with. Quick. Three. Two, one. It's 
too early. Oh, for fuck's sakes. <laughs> prince, 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 turn around, yeah. Let me tell you something. Let me tell you something! There we go. We did it. For reasons unknown except to them, the gods <laughs> have chosen to punish me with defeat. But do not think your cowardice will be forgotten. What Damn cowardice? It. You're still going on about that? Need to clear this up once and for all. Had to abandon your mother's camp back then because someone else needed my help. Badly. Oh? Couldn't I don't remember this them. quest. Didn't want to, in fact. You mean to say you had a secret mission set off to accomplish it, having vowed to tell no one of its nature until you did? And now, have you checked general Minus chat and discord? And uh, I'd still rather not divulge the nature of my secret mission. To match Give the stash and the glasses and everything else. <laughs> In agreeing to duel, you proved yourself a true knight. Thus, I accept your word as that of a man of honor. Glad to hear it. Now I got work to do. Bye, bitch. If wasn't it? I think he did threaten it, like... Because if he had the opportunity, he would have killed me, lads. In all honesty. <laughs> I like a little goatee. My heart swells to behold this beautiful celebration of valor and honor, and to witness you, who embody the Girl, chivalric Girl, you literally have no emotion. Strive for greatness. Yet, after a time of combat must come a time of peace and respite. Thus, I invite all who fought in the tourney to this feast held in your, and none others, honor. And should any among you crave solitude, private tents await you nearby. The group melee shall take place on the morrow. Glory shall be within grasp for Chicken. each and every one of you. The best among you shall have the honor to face our reigning champion. Ooh, to face a reigning champion, you Grégoire say. Grégoire de Gourgon, victor of last year's tourney. Celebrate, make merry, revel <laughs> as you will. Yet be mindful Is he really of tall? Awaits you tomorrow. <laughs> what is that ridiculous emote you are using? Keck chicken. Follow her. We shall meet in your tent before your last contest. You must help her. Yes, because she definitely won't know I'm following her right now. Oh, before I move on though, really quickly, I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna talk to this innkeeper really quickly. Oh no, I'm bugged. Oh. Wait, where's the innkeeper? Why are you? Why is there so many people here? Oh. Noble woman, noble woman. Oh, for fuck's sake, you cunts! Whatever, I'm gonna run after her. Grey dome scoundrel, ever seeking Lady Vivian. Some kind of I wanted to get the cards from your one. Hmm. Strange. Was sure I'd find her here. Vanished. Melted into thin air. And that bird. She Bruxa flew off. Worth going after. She's a burb. She's a little burb. We're following Looks the like burb chat. Leading me somewhere. Now I want chicken, specifically Korean fried. 
Uh, I've no Korean food in Waterford. It sucks. I would love to live nearby any half-assed decent Korean restaurant. I am happy that there's decent Indian here. But, and I haven't experimented enough with Japanese food here. I don't think I've actually ordered any Japanese food here. I'm a little bit scared to order Japanese, to be honest. The one or two times I've had an upset tummy has been due to Japanese food and trying new restaurants. Which is weird, because I usually like Japanese food. Oh! Oh my god! A panther?! What the fuck?! Here, kitty, 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 kitty! Damn! It seems, uh, it seems it doesn't matter big cat or small cat. <laughs> All cats seem to dislike Geralt. I love Korean food. I haven't had enough of it, but I do... Any, any bit that I have had has been amazing. Jesus. There's so many panthers here. They're gonna go extinct if I continue at this rate. Maybe the cat will run away. Yeah, kimchi is lovely. I love kimchi. I like de de generally fermented cabbage. Like, sauerkraut is great. And, you know, in Russia we have our marinated salted cabbage as well. So most cultures have them. And I make gimbap all the time as well. Of course, I'm limited to what's available for me. Stream lagging for anyone else? Let me check. On my end, I'm okay. My bitrate is fine. Tell me when we're back. To Are we back together yet? Twitch just doing Twitch things. It does... It does for me, but I thought it's my connection. Okay, we're good now. Okay, good. Um, I don't think it's my internet. I think it might be Twitch things. That's the second time this happened on Twitch, actually. If I was living in my old place, I might have been suspicious. Oh, here, sorry. Ugh. Sorry, I need a text back. It's about the job. Twitch be twitching. Job, yeah, just a small part-time job. Um, making educational content for University of Limerick for physics. So it's working from home kind of thing. Be nice to earn a couple of a couple of dollars. I need a dollar, dollar, dollar is all I need. Oh, oh boy, that doesn't sound right. Wait, follow the bird? Okay, I'm glad we're staying away from a scary cave. Sounds up. Ah, we'll see, we'll see. Uh, like I said, I only just got the information today. I need to do all the emails and stuff like that. So I might write an email after this stream. What's going on here? <gasps> She's a burp! 
Lady Vivian. Counted on me getting lost. I did. I thought you no different from the knights. Good at tourneys, hopeless in the face of true danger. I was mistaken. She's a burb! So not actually a Bruxa. A what? Suspicion I had that you might be a vampire. Certain details seemed to confirm it. Then I changed my mind. Anyway, Anyways. <laughs> important. Here you come to this clearing often. This is where it all began. And as I was not able to evade you, save myself from you, then I want it done here. In this very spot. Oh, she thinks I'm here to kill her. I'm not gonna kill her. Done. While you are a witcher, you were hired to kill me, were you not? <laughs> then do so. Now. And do it quickly, I beg you. Ooh, I shan't she has a big Witchers chance. only hunt monsters. And even then, not all. You're no monster. Then what am I to your eyes? Hold that. Only thing I've figured out so far is you're no danger to anyone. Hope to learn more, though. If you've no contract on my life, why take an interest at all? The feathers are strategically Could placed, aren't they? To it? Is that why? He wanted to help you. Asked me to do him a favor. Frankly, if I can do something for you, I'll do it willingly. Why should I trust you? Because the Duchess trusts me. Because I'm a freak, too. Because <laughs> cases like yours are my bread and butter. Take your pick. You shall not turn on me. Use what I say against me. You shall not tell anyone. You got nothing to fear. Came here to help you. And I won't peep a word to anyone unless I decide it's absolutely necessary. So what's wrong? Is she cursed? Uh, She's really pretty. So be it. I shall tell you what my mama once told me. When she was with child, expecting me, she and my father spent much time together near the wood, here in this clearing. Mama loved to listen to the Orioles sing. She would stroke her belly and say, My daughter should be as beautiful as that bird. Such is my wish. But a creature dwelt in the wood who envied my parents their happiness. One day it appeared before them to say the whole wood belonged to it. And they had dared to delight in something that was not theirs. She was cursed all her life, it seems. And when my parents said that they had nothing, <gasps> they claimed their unborn daughter as its own. Oh, damn. What did the creature look like? Parents what kind ever of creature? Describe the creature? They called it a nymph born of the deep woods. A nymph? With no mother or father. But I was too young, too distraught by the curse's onset to ask after details. Damn. What happened after that? Nothing at first. I came into the world a perfectly normal child, and my parents forgot that day's events. But 15 summers into my life, the curse began to show. Initially, only when the moon was full. Oh, but she's now like it's well. advanced so that even in daytime, I must use magic ointment to mask its symptoms, to look normal. Oh, Thus, that's the magic scenty thingy secret, she had in her room. Me. In fact, I was resigned to death in coming here. Perhaps death would be preferable to my complete and permanent transformation. For I fear that is what lies in store. Ointment you use includes a potent magic. Oh, there's deers in the background. You don't have the immunity mages have. There's plenty of deer for us to run over. <laughs> or normal doses too long, and it could be dangerous to you. I sensed this. The very reason I knew I would have to give it up in the end and bid my human form a final farewell. Oh dear. The curse. It could be reversed. Tiny too dear. Once ran into a baron transformed into a cormorant, ostensibly for good. Managed to cure him completely. And you truly think you could do something like this for me? Can't guarantee a thing. Tough case yours. You were cursed before birth. That alone complicates things. Mm, it's not also, her curse, basically. Curse is She's, she hold. is the curse. Symptoms are progressing. Could try transferring the curse onto someone else. What? Out of the question. I shall not allow oh, she it to has ruin a tail. life. Look at the cute tail. 
Only one that's completely safe. So there is another. All right, <laughs> there is another. Are you guys pulling out Ancient as many ritual. bourbon moats? We'd need an Oriole egg. Should release the curse's grip permanently. Gotta warn you, though. Could have serious consequences. Consequences? What kind? Curse was cast before you came into this world. Ritual involved transferring it to an as yet unhatched chick. You'd be free. Thing is, you could be left with the average lifespan of an <gasps> Seven years. I understand. Alas, every rose has its thorn, and there are no happy endings. Yet, truth be told, I never thought I would get one. I came here prepared to die, yet you wish to give me seven years of life. Real life, free no. life. This is no dilemma. I agree wholeheartedly. I see why. I understand. Don't have to decide just yet. Think it through. I will. They must miss me at the tawny grounds by now. Shall we return? Let's. But are you gonna... Are you gonna turn into uh, a bird? Yes. I cannot appear there all in feathers. Pardon me for a moment. What's this curse called? Uh, it's it's the night quest. I'll check in a minute. Oh? Dipping in the water clears it? You can change it, Will? No. I didn't realize. But I discovered the water of this pool helps. Its effects are brief, but I can always be sure of them. Hmm. Interesting. Oh, look at your bobby. It's a bobby. Come. Does she happen to have clothes lying around? <coughs> Excuse me. I mean, achoo! Excuse me. Did you learn anything? Yeah. Bless you. Thank Speak, you. Man. Can you not see I'm out of my I'm mind? I'm very ladylike with my what ails her. With my uh, She asked me not sneezes. to talk about it. But I want only the best for her. Perhaps I shall be able to help or I don't Okay, know. after you doing I'm that, never mind to take least. it back. <laughs> you don't like my ladylike sneeze? I'm such a lady, you know. Vivian gave me the details of her situation. But she did so in confidence. Promised I wouldn't tell anyone. But I'm not just anyone. Why, I would do anything for her. I was the one to ask you to help her. You cannot shut me out now. I'm sorry. Look, in time Vivian will come to understand what she owes you. I'm sure of it. But until then, you gotta understand the whole world doesn't revolve around you. Ooh. How dare you lecture me? That's but This sassy. is not the aid I sought. And to think I gave up my spot in the tourney to you. I regret it now. Do you even intend to compete to the end? Yeah. Or now that you've bound Vivian to your terms, you no longer see the need? Hey! Stop being so angry at me. I don't back out of anything. I'll take part in the last skirmish. Besides, Vivian will be busy till attorney's end. Indeed. In that case, you must meet the other knights of your team. They await near the arena's entrance by the, by training, the training ground. ground. Got it. Thanks. Bum, bada bum, bada bada bum, bum, bum. Oh, sorry. Ah, uh, no, I still. Sorry, I haven't been able to check what the quest is called. Two teams rosters. I shall be captain of ours. That means you shall do as I say for the duration of the fight. Is this clear? Sir, Palmer yes, sir. Will lead the opposing team. With this skirmish, we commemorate the Battle of Fox Hollow of 1218. When a hands of southern outlaws led by Haller the Brown with the name Vivian, I see. Okay, sorry, I tried. Brave knights. I just haven't been in the game for a while. It's all cutscenes. <laughs> Since that day, knights errant have guarded the Duchy's borders. Palmerin drew the short straw, so his team shall play the barbarian Haller's men. Any questions? No, sir. No. no. I doubt you will do us any good. 
You know nothing of knightly combat as a witch. Oh, shut up, you Nightly pheasant head. It is time, gentlemen. Take your weapons and proceed to the arena. A cheer for the knights, the ladies, the lords. For our, our next, next entertainment, entertainment, the team shall cross swords. Two rifle crews, two coteries shall fight full tilt till one dropped to its knees. That didn't really rhyme that well, did it? Virtue is yours, or Lance they should have hired Eminem to do all the rhyming. Shall forever be branded as shameful, obscene. While the knights prepare, let me say I'm elated to behold such a crowd on edge, breath baited. Whoever here wins, the past champion shall face. All others must leave, heads bowed in disgrace. So, what do we vote, chat? Is my look good? Do I have a, look, a good look? Let us begin! Vote Resaracus! Blood, sweat, and tears shall soon Whew. follow in bucket. Blood, sweat, and tears. Let's go. Charge! Oh, sorry, I didn't mean to set you on fire. And I set fire to the rain. Watch it burn down. Oh, my empowered attack didn't hit. Oh, let's eat some candy. Basically, this this whole fight becomes really difficult. Like if if we if we were doing this combat IRL, right? I think this fight would become absolutely difficult the minute one person falls, because it's not a one v one anymore. It's basically, yeah, it's tough. I think if we were to take this seriously. Wait, I can't go into my inventory, but my sword is broken. Ow. Nice. Oh! Nice finish. Have I missed permit A38? Hello, Thomas. First blood open. Yeah, I think first blood would be too strong in these kind of situations in a 5v5. in tornies as in life, but one champion may reign. Today, he is the one. Praised be his name. He felt a whole host slew the most. To Geralt of Rivia, who the strength of lions boasts. He sailed through all trials. Each test he passed with ease. But now, yeah, the everyone else seems disappointed. Would it bring him to his knees? For Gregoire de Gorgon, who on this ground last won, shall spar him for the title, and the day is done. To the tired remainder, we salute your endeavors. Return to your wives, your loves, your whomevers. <laughs> do, 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 do. They could have made you use wooden swords. True. True. Ah, but what's what's love without a little bit of good injury? It is time. Step into the arena. Should you suffer grievous harm during combat, have you any last wishes? <laughs> missives you wish passed to your loved ones? Thanks, I'm fine. The Witcher of Rithia, gathered Kill the his name, though aged be his visage. You mean Eminem? This is Eminem, his, his descendant. White, no, his ancestor, not his descendant. Feist. Now entering the grounds, a tight ton of infamy. Gregoire de Gorgon, victor, victor of Las Las Holy. It's I really interesting to see the helmet, because that helmet shape I've seen in a lot of medieval... Pacing I can't repair my sword, guys. The dames and messieurs are victor at the 
champion, the unequaled, ah. and silent, Gregoire de Gorgon! Hip, huh? hip, hooray! Hooray! Don't mind me eating candy. Now a few words from my sponsor. Phones and teeth drink to go. A sponsor! A quick word from our sponsor. Oh, that's brilliant. Do I not need to defeat him fully? Obtain a flawless victory this in all the competitions. Champion. Nice, I got, a, I got a Steam he quest. De Gorgon. Hail Geralt, Herald, Herald. <laughs> <laughs> oh, this poet is brilliant. Wow, it's we got a sword. Oh, look, I have a crown. <laughs> Did you see my glasses disappear? My glasses disappeared. His vow he made upon the garter of her illustrious highness, Anna Henrietta. Doubtless the Duchess's grace carried him to the <laughs> splendid victory. He showed great courage, great strength, great composure. He fought nobly with honor and thus rightfully deserves the title of this year's champion of the arena. Tap, 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 tap. Not now. We shall meet later in my tent. I have duties to attend to, as do you. Geralt of Rivia's oh, sword. God. New item oh, received. Smile and wave, boys. Smile and wave. <laughs> it's ridiculous. <laughs> to her garter? Yeah, that's the dialect I chose, Nas. I was having a bit of a laugh, but the, the game let me do it. Oh, look at the setting. It's so pretty. Getting in her den, maybe you should have kept the stones. True, true. Greetings, my lady. Have you decided? I have. I stand by all I have said. I wish to endanger no one and thus choose the method involving an egg. If it's to be the egg of an Oriole, I know where to find one. There is a nest in my clearing. Might you explain the nature of the ritual? It's exact course. Sure, but seems your tent's grown ears. Show yourself, Guillaume. Can hear you breathing, <gasps> and I know damn well it's you. Little shit. Well, he's Why just are you in love. Here, sir? Or a stream is stuttering. A oh, audience. is it stuttering again? I'm so sorry. It was stuttering earlier, true, but on my end, it seems okay. Geralt, what is the meaning of this? Is this some scheme you've hatched unbeknownst to me? Okay. Guillaume's no foe. Though there's little honor in meddling, he meant well, means well. You guessed correctly. He was the one to hire me, but only because he wanted to help Yeah, you. but I didn't ha My say lady, anything. I live to serve you. Whatsoever you require, you need but beckon. I'm yours to command. Are you quite finished? Is that all you wish to say? I... I, I suppose so. <laughs> so you shall do what I command, sir. Very well, then. Listen carefully. Leave this tent. Turn towards the Duchy's northern marches and run. Run until the tawny grounds are no longer within sight. Return only once you've cooled off. And leave me be forevermore. Understood? You tell him. My lady, but your your troubles. I, I only wish the, the witchers see. Out now! You assured me I could trust you. I didn't tell him I anything. I kept your secret. Didn't tell him anything he didn't already know. 
I understand he hired you, so you had to report to him. But this is not his affair, Geralt. This is my life. The worst she can say sure is no. Did the right thing. Not Refreshing did not. I'm sorry. Help. I don't think it's on Can't my end, Omicron. I'm, I'm sorry, but needed someone who'd willingly assume the. It doesn't seem like too many people are saying and that you they. you thought I would agree to this? No, Geralt. When we spoke in the meadow, you told me of a ritual which required no lusty knights to aid us. This is the method I wish to pursue. Okay, let's go get the egg, so. Need to find an egg, preferably an Oriole's. Ritual itself isn't complicated, but like I said before, there'll be a side effect. Still sure you want to go through with it? Yes. I saw a nest in the clearing where we spoke. But before we go, tell me, what will become of the chick? We'll have to break the egg. Like you said, not everyone gets a happy ending. And for a dream to come true, there must be sacrifices. Very well. Damn, Let she was go. feeling bad about it. Bird eggs. Damn. Dead burb. Well, that's probably the mama bird flying around us too. That's kind of sad, if you think about it. I don't know how rare or how popular oriole birds are. I'm never hurt. I don't know if I know of the bird Oriole. I don't know if it's a real bird or not. This is the place. I haven't been able to repair my sword for a while. Let me put on my glasses. I have important glasses to wear here. Ooh, we have a bunny helmet, maybe. Where did my bunny helmet? Did I not pick up a bunny helmet? I thought I'd have a bunny helmet. <clears throat> Killing monsters whole day and then feeding bad about it feels a bit. Uh, no, not me. Sorry, I was talking about oh, no! Vivian. A panther's oh. got at the nest. Stand back. I'll take care of this. No! What? Ow. Holy shit. Quickly looted before the cutscene. fell on a moss patch. They're fine except for one. It's cracked. Will it do? Think so. Oh no, the mama is watching us. Now what must I do? Just to be sure, gonna ask one last Let's time. Let's make sure she's Positive ready for this. Want to do this. If we succeed, the changes will be irreversible. You'll probably also only have seven years left to live, at the most. Seven years free of the fear that someone might spy me at the wrong moment? Of the stigma of being a freak? A but monster? But you're cute! Seven years of a life both Honestly, she's really cute. The way yes, she is as a burp. Kissing might be rough, you have to be careful not to like scrape right. yourself. But other than that, I wouldn't mind being in a relationship with a burp. You need to concentrate now. Repeat after me. Muna Gandrao. Muna Finerat. Muna Gandrao. Muna Finerat. She could take Garrus. Ah! Oh, exactly! Gandrao. I found Garrus' perfect Finerat. match. Muana Gandrao. Muana Finerat. Did it work? Damn it. Geralt! Look! Look! Oh, My God. necklace is always broken. I shall broken. be able to attend balls! I shall travel to Oxenford! 
to Novigrad even. Thank you, Witcher. How to thank Guillaume. He's the one hired me to help you. Yes, I'm grateful to him as well, immensely. Will you tell him so for me? You should tell him yourself, girl. Yeah, shouldn't you tell him yourself? Should tell him yourself, don't Beak you? Beak would be in the way of kissing, though. Sure, but you Perhaps can work around it. But I would prefer not. There's no obstacle that the tofu will take on. Convey my gratitude to him in my stead. Please, be so kind. Sure, I'll tell him. Farewell, Vivian. I thought the design of her was kind of cute, to be honest, the way they did the burp. They didn't make her like just bur like bird feathers on her body like a dress and make her like ridiculously beautiful. There was still something like very monster-esque about her for sure. Move it. But they still made her beautiful enough, I think. The sky is so pretty. Look at that sky. Would you just look at that? Just look at that. That is a freaking artwork. Oh my god, look at this scenery. Oh, come on. Come on, oh, for Roach. For fuck's sakes, Roach, move. Ah, oh, this horse! Stresses me out. So much nicer than Fields of Corpses back in Novigrad. True. Although I did like Valen. The, the swamp setting was kind of nice as well. I don't know. Am I wrong in saying that? I feel like the swamp was quite cozy in Witcher. I, I enjoyed the swampy area of Witcher. And look at the reflection of the sky and the water. Oh. Look at that. Oh, it's a boar! <laughs> Damn! Oh my god. I'm gonna die to a boar. Holy shit! I almost got wrecked by this boar! More IRL animals in this DLC. Yeah, there's... So we don't see rabbits now, you see hares as well. I don't know if that was normal in the other games, but I thought the other ones were rabbits before. You can't pull one over on me, Witcher. I can see your the peasant misery, peasant misery simulator. Yeah, I don't know the woods and the swamp and all of that. I really enjoyed that setting. Geralt, the drowners and the hags were lovely. <laughs> really, you guys don't like it? Truly? Maybe I'm the only so person who liked well. Velen. Her troubles are done. Asked me to give you a message. Said she's grateful. Thanks to you, she can live a normal life. Good, good. But how does she fare? I'm not Vivian tell him. It's her decision her to tell him. She's completely free now. And happy, I think. Without me. You helped her. But that doesn't mean she owes you her love. Got this bard friend. Philosopher too, I guess. Amateur. He'd say, if you love somebody, set them free. Do you know what, Geralt? You earned your reward, so take it. But keep your advice to yourself. Adieu. Damn. Damn. He'd be sassy. He'd be sassy! Yeah. All I did was try to give him advice. All I did was try to give him advice. This is what happens when you give unsolicited, unsolicited advice to someone.